Good evening. Welcome to Tom Adams Field on the campus of Wayne State University. We're just underway here in the kickoff classic. Riley Wilcox here with Kim Lindsay, and we are underway. Davison held on the first uh, offensive possession for Southfield a and and has just picked up our initial first down. We're at midfield. Cannon Hall is your quarterback. Tariq Reed to his right. Cannon Hall, quarterback this year, a junior, looking over to Coach Zimmerman for the play. Reed up the middle, he's got some room here. Busts it down to the 30. First down, Cardinals. Sorry for the technical difficulties, a little uh, short here in the box tonight. So Randy, Randy's standing on his head trying to get us going. First and 10 at the 30, there are eight minutes exactly left here in the first quarter. No score, Davison's opening possession. This is Reed, nope, up the middle goes Hall. Picks up about nine, down to the 21. Whoa, we got fisticuffs already. Garrett Goyette going at it a little bit there with the defensive back for Southfield A&T. Second and one. Cardinals at the Southfield A&T 21-yard line here in the opening quarter. Right, wide to the right is Anthony Fordham. Hall, the left-hander, in the gun. Long snap count, keeps it. He's going up the middle. He's going to have six right here. Cannon Hall scores on Davison's first possession of the 2017 football season. 21 yards straight up the middle. It's a nice start, Riley. Lots of graduations on that Davison team from last year. Only five starters coming back. Who is the kicker? We had a long time kicker. So it looks like Carson, no, Carson McLaughlin is the holder. Cannon Hall will kick the extra point. And it is missed to the right. So Davison gets started very quickly. Good stay on defense, good stop, and then takes the ball over on their own 25 or 35, marches 65 yards to touchdown on that opening drive. No passes so far. To kick off for Davison is number 34, who's not on our roster. Oh, here we go. It's Zach Simpson. Carter is deep for Southfield AT. And the kickoff, we have offsides, I think. Davison called timeout. No offsides on Davison. Refereeing crew did the first game tonight, too. Beautiful setting here in downtown Detroit. Out to my right is the Motor, Motor City Casino and the Rensen. And we're looking at Harwell Field here on the campus of Wayne State University. I didn't check the score, but I assume the Tigers lost again this afternoon. That's a good assumption. <laughs> here we go again. 
This kickoff is taken at the five yard line by Javante de Brioran, and he is taken down by number two, Ray Cole, a junior. At the 23, where AT will start first and 10 for their second possession of the game. AT is quarterbacked uh, by number one, John Darby. He's a senior. Davison's defense was stout on the opening possession. A.T. also runs that spread offense. Quarterback is in the gun. The give is up the middle to number nine, Marcus Fuqua, a junior. He picks up eight out to the Davis in 32. Make it the 31. Second and two. Fuqua again, this time he's taken down in the backfield by number 24, Gabe Ellis. Senior. He lost three back to the 28. Southfield going with tempo, no huddle. Third and five. Quarterback to throw it. Going down the sideline, he's overthrown, I think. No, it's caught. That's going to be six for Matthew Gilbert. He outruns Ray Cole in a really nice pass by Darby. And the game is tied, at least for the moment. 75-yard pass play. Southfield a on the board. And T to attempt the extra point. The young man who just caught the touchdown pass is going to kick it. Davison missed its extra point after its opening touchdown. Straight on kicker. That was partially blocked. And it was missed also wide to the right. So carbon copies there. You know, this is a great competition because Southfield a and and the Davison Cardinals have never matched up before. a and is only in its second year of existence. Southfield High and Southfield Lathrop merged together last year. They play in the OAA Red, which we're familiar with. We lost to Clarkston last year in the district championship. Clarkston also on that side of the OAA. Five forty-seven left here in the opening quarter. We are tied, six apiece. Gilbert to kick off. That extra point was a straight on. You don't see that anymore. Almost everybody's soccer style. It looks like he kicks off that way too. Right down the middle. Ooh, nice return here. This is Ellis, number 24. He gets out to the 40. Mark him at the 41. It'll be first and 10 for the Cardinals right there. They've not thrown a pass yet. Everything was runs in the first possession. Just 
Davison slow to come out of the huddle. Got a very spread formation, empty backfield. Cannon Hall looks to throw. Over the top, overthrown. Almost a pick there intended for number 10, Max Slazak. formation there, Riley. Second and 10 for the Cardinals. Reed is in the slot to the right. Goyette is to his left near the quarterback. Hall in the shotgun. Inside give to Reed. Mm gains nothing this time. Stopped right at the line of scrimmage. Third down and 10. Looks like a lot of chatter going on down there already. So Davison faced with its first long third down. minutes exactly left here in the opening quarter. We're 6-6. Six, six. Reed goes in motion to the left. Hall to throw it. Got a wheel. Reed is just standing wide open at the top of the screen. He never got rid of the ball. Didn't, didn't see it develop. The wheel route was wide open. Although we have a flag, looks like we have a flag. I don't see one on the field though. Now we have a flag, intentional grounding. Yep, never got past the line of scrimmage and he threw it to a lineman. So Davison's gonna be forced to punt after the walk off of the penalty. Wow, that's a spot walk off from the throw. So all the way back to the 25. Cannon Hall does everything. He's the punter too. Deep for Southfield, there's number 11, Cameron McEvans. Hall's punt is a low driver. Fielded cleanly and tackled immediately by number three, Cal Stefanko, on those special teams. AT will take over at their own 43 with 431 left here in the opening quarter. The score is Davis and six, Southfield AT six. Southfield burned. Davison with a long pass on the last possession. Darby's in the gun. McEvans to his right. Darby keeps. He's got a nice gain. First down to the Davison, 46. Tackled by number five, Carrington Terry. It's first down. The running back for Antius Fuqua, number nine. Nobody on the slot receiver to the right. <laughs> Quarterback's looking down that sideline again. Same play. Overthrown this time. Double coverage there. Would have taken a perfect pass. Second and 10.
They go quick. This is Fuqua. Runs through the tackle at the line of scrimmage and a couple of more. He picks up all the way down to the 42, a gain of, or 40, uh, 38, a gain of eight. It'll be third and short. 32, I'm sorry, 32 is the running back, Eric McCarron. No, we are moving this time. Going to move back five. Got a little offsides there, Kim. Yeah, mobile motion. All right. How about this weather here today? You couldn't get a it's better perfect. for a first football game? Usually it's very, very warm. I <laughs> know. That's perfect. Yeah, third week of August, you're you're talking hot and humid, but we, we, we do a good one here. This feels like an October game. Absolutely. Talked to some of the kids today before we got in, and they were so excited to play in a big stadium and yeah, this in front is very, of a big crowd. Very cool. Darby's in the gun. McCain is, or Quain is to his right. Now we have motion again. <laughs> oh, it's offside. Now we stepped in. Jeez. <laughs> Gave him back the five we just took, right? Uh, <laughs> third and eight. Back to uh, third and short again. And these are some of the things you work out in week one, right? You, Absolutely. You'd like to work them out earlier, but sometimes it doesn't happen until the second or third week. So you get, Check get out the shoes on number two there. Look at the gold plates on the back of <laughs> Those are probably some Kanye West. He's the he's the <laughs> kicker. <laughs> well, kickers are supposed to have good looking cleats, right? Yeah, that's right. He's the only one for that long touchdown earlier. <laughs> They're set up heavy to the right. Look at the size of that tight end in the backfield. Oh yeah. That's uh that's a big boy right there. Give us to McCarran up the middle. Nice tackle on the outside out there, but he does, I believe, pick up a first down. He does. Mm -hmm. Tackle by number 18 of the Cardinals, Tyrese Watson. I'll tell you, so far we've seen this Southfield team's not afraid to let them fly, so I wouldn't be, wouldn't be surprised as they get closer to the end zone here if they take another shot. Senior quarterback, lots of experience. First and 10, they're at the Davis and 35. McCarn again. Oh, no, it's a nice fake. Fake me out. Toss up there to the big tight end, number 18. That's Devin Baldwin. He puts a lick on. Whoa, the Davison defender is slow to get up there. Oh, yeah, he's a little woozy. And that appears to Aaron be. Aaron Gilmore. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. we got concussion protocol here. And that's a big boy he had a collision with right there. Picked up 11. That's a first down for A&T down to the Davison 24, and they're on the march. Okay, he's up and walking off now, so that's good. Uh, there's still got to be concussion protocol on that one. Yeah, definitely. They'll be looking at him on the side. And it looks like for our defense there, we just missed the back coming out of the backfield there. Then, you know, tight end slot there. He just kind of went out of the backfield and found there was nobody there for him. Absolutely. Fake the announcer out. <laughs> PA announcer's got a great voice. Uh, Is that the one? I don't know if, wonder if that's the regular Wayne State announcer. It could be. It could be. Blake Grice Brunson now, number 40, appears to be the tailback. Whoa, high snap. Gathered in by the quarterback, Darby, and he's stopped for a one yard loss after that. Bottom of that pile is number 20 for the Cardinals, Chase Chittick. A lot of graduations last year, a lot of, a lot of holes to be filled this year. Yeah, that's absolutely true. I know the offensive line got really decimated, a lot of people on the defense, so a lot of new people out here. They're learning on the fly tonight. You know it. <laughs> We've got a split in the slot to each side. Darby to throw, maybe? Yep. Looking across. Got a man on the outside. Really nice open field yeah. tackle out there by Tyrese Watson. Yeah. Very short gain. Yeah, great tackle. Anytime they throw out to the sideline on a one-on-one, -on -one, you got to make that tackle. That's exactly what they did. That was, was uh, on the island, for yeah. sure. I believe that was Ray Cole on that. Was that who that was, number two? 19. 19, okay. That or 18. 18. 18. Tyrese. Oh, yep. Tyrese Watson. Yep. So it's third down and seven from the 21. Warren Fordorn. 
four down territory, I would think, here for ANT. Yeah, and I would expect them to go right back to the air here. Everybody's got a little, uh, little bling on the shoe there. <laughs> that must be the thing this year. Must be. <laughs> the thing with the bling. <laughs> Everything's loaded to the right, and they run that way. Oh, on the inside right. gear, oh. that's going to go. Same guy. Yes, sir. Number two, Matthew Gilbert takes it in from 21 yards out, and A&T goes on top. Great kick out block, allowed him to get to the corner, and that was the end of the story. You couldn't catch him with that speed. Absolutely. Oh. 29 seconds left. A&T goes up 12-6 here in the opening quarter. Yeah, Davidson finds themselves in a hole, but uh, but they've been known to bounce back, so we'll see how they, they play it out here when after the kickoff. Just concerned about speed when we before this game began. So yeah. we don't see this on a consistent basis in the, mm -hmm. in the Valley. And when you're dealing with speed, you gotta you gotta play fundamentally strong. You you give up one corner, and that's that's a that's a six points right there. Yeah, they really loaded up. We didn't shift. Hmm. Gonna go for two here after the missed extra mm -hmm. point early on. A lot of guys with their hands on their hips on that defense. You don't like to see that. They're a little frustrated. You can see. <laughs> Got to get the offense to sustain something here. Mm-hmm. All right, here we go. Two-point conversion try. Big time loaded up on the left side here. Add one more. Now we got a timeout called by ENT. Couldn't quite get their package together. Didn't know what they wanted to do there when they got to the yeah, line. Yeah, people looks like. were in the wrong spots again. Yeah, yeah that's another week one first, thing. Yeah, first nights. Mm -hmm. Kind of a nice setting. Yeah. Watching the sun set down on the uh, Ambassador Bridge. Rinson. Down. Top, top of uh, Ford Field. Downtown Detroit. You can even see Little Caesars Arena there peeking over the top. Sure can. Yeah. Pretty didn't, re didn't realize Wayne State had a green monster in their left field. Look at the baseball field there. Oh, they do. They got a mini Fenway down yeah, there, huh? Yeah, it looks like it's probably 30, 40 feet high. <laughs> That's the probably to stop the balls from hitting the lodge out there, huh? That's probably why it's there. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good crowd tonight, too. Yeah, the Davison side's full, plus they're spilled over here. Mm -hmm. A couple of really nice games tomorrow, too, headlined by that Lowell De La Salle game. Uh, we got something going on here. Must be motion. Yep. So the two-point try is going to be from the eight-yard line. Or maybe they'll kick it now. Tell you a great story we had here at Wayne State. Uh, we came down, DTV came down to cover uh, a game between Wayne State and Saginaw Valley. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and the uh, center for the Saginaw Valley team was, uh, uh, was, a, uh, was a Davidson graduate. And the nose guard from Wayne State was also Davis as a graduate. That was Ryan Hankins and um, oh, a four. One of Caleb, the four. Caleb, Caleb four. four yeah. Yeah. Caleb He's four. He's now the head coach at Kersley. He, oh, is he really? Yes. Oh, Kersley's trying to trying to come back with some Davidson grads. I yep. like it. Yep. Yeah, and that was a great game to see those two squaring off against each other in a, in a you know Division two college game. That was a, that was a sight to see. Darby, you throw it. It's got the slot. Oh, our defender just never turned. Yeah, that was a great. Carrington Terry was right there in position, but he was following the inside receiver. And ran that, that slant play into perfection right there. So it's 14-6 with 29 seconds left here in the opening quarter. a &T on top. Deep in the middle for the Cardinals for this kickoff return is Austin Rowland. He provided a few highlight reel plays last year. Yeah, he was known to fake a pe few people out of those fancy cleats. Yes, he was. Between him and Reed, there were some, some highlights to speak about last year. Gilbert to kick for A&T. Rowan is deep, but he went away from him last time. It was Gabe Ellis on the return. It's good scouting. My guess is they'll go away again, probably mm -hmm. to the left side this time. 
Yeah, kick it to one of the up backs probably. They did. It is. Oh, go yep. Right up the middle. It's Lamar Hay, I believe, number 25. Mm -hmm. La Lamar, a strong <laughs> young man, still moving the pile. Running like a fullback. That little Tom Rathman there on that. Keep waiting <laughs> to see him on the offense. Yeah, yeah. Get him in to get a couple tough yards. That'd be nice. I thought the plan was to maybe have two running backs back there, one on each side, but so far that's not the f what we've been seeing for formations. Davison takes over first and 10 on their own 41. Probably the last play here in the quarter. We've got 20 seconds left. Fast first quarter. That first game between West Bloomfield and Wald Lake Western took three hours to play, but I only saw three running plays. The I watched most of the second half. Mm -hmm. Everything was in the air, so that makes the game very long. Yeah, and that's what uh, kind of delayed us a little bit sure from did. getting here on time. Bunched up formation here for the cards. Inside give. This is Roland. Trying to use his speed, and he gets to the 46, I think. See where they mark him. Actually to the 47. Yeah, that's a good pickup on first down. And second and uh, four. And we got the wind with us here. There's a, there's a, there's a slight of a breeze heading into our end zone. Let's see, if, uh, let's see if we try to use that before the end of the quarter here. But I would m probably say they're going to kick to the state of the ground here. Yeah, they switched up and tried to throw a pass on first down last possession, and it kind of put them behind the, the sticks. Yep. Out, went out of bounds, so we'll get another play here in the first quarter. Reed has been contained a little bit so far. First possession, he had a couple of nice runs, and this is him now, and they bunch him up again. Actually lost. Whoa, guys, we got a whistle yeah. uh, about five seconds ago. Yeah, they let that. They let him keep pushing him on that one. I'm, if they do that one or two more times, I might see a flag come out. That's the end of the first quarter. It's 14 for Southfield a and six for your Davidson Cardinals. Very fast-paced first quarter. Zimmerman doing his P.J. Fleck over there, except he's not sprinting. Did you get your picture taken in the big chairs over there, Randy? <laughs> All right, big play for the Cardinals here early on. It's third and four at their own 47. Looks like that new offensive line is trying to feel its way around at the moment. Hall rolls, cuts up, he's got to get going. It's going to be short of the first down. So Davison's going to be forced to punt here. Oh, well now we got a flag. See who that's on. That could be a first down. On us or on them? Let's see, no indication yet. Personal foul on Davison. That's definitely not what you want to do. Already stopped. Now you're going to go back 15. So Davison will punt. We're just underway in the second quarter. 20 seconds in. Hall will punt it away. Deep for a &T, it looks like uh, Cameron McEvans. Good roll, turns over for him. 
Ball's going to go dead at the 36, where a &T will take over. They've scored on their last two possessions. Aaron Gilmore must not have been hurt. He's right back out there on the line of scrimmage. Sure looked to me like he got his uh, bell rung. Darby in the gun. He gives up the middle. To Fuqua. Picks up a couple. He's second and eight. Timeout Davison. Not sure what that's about. So Davison burns its first time out of the half. Southfield has used one as well. was the first week of school? Rough. <laughs> Rough. <laughs> a lot. Work. You know, you can hear the, um, the student section all the way up here, which is surprising because they didn't have... Oh, that's our student section. Yeah, they didn't have a bus to get here. Yep. All right, second and let's call it nine for A&T. Darby looks to throw. Short route. Oh, should have been picked. Ball right into the hands of Cal Stefanko, number three. Didn't have time to get both hands up to react. It's going to be third and long for A&T. Anthony Fordham trying to exonerate the student section to get loud. All right, we've got a split in a slot to both sides here. So far, there's been no blitzing from the Davison defense. Looking back on the inside screen. Is the ball picked or not? Nope, the ball is incomplete. It's going to be fourth down, and the Davison defense does its job. One yard gain on those three plays from scrimmage. Roland goes deep. Along with Caleb Smith, I believe that's 17. Having trouble, he's got his jersey rolled up. Oh, not a good punt there. Off the side of the foot, straight out of bounds. What a... Referees didn't do a whole lot there to get in position to see where that went out of bounds because I think it was actually about the 45 on the other side of the field. The referee didn't move at all. Looks like he's having a little trouble running. Which begs referees, all of our referees in all sports are getting old, really need some help. It's going to become a problem in a couple of years. All right, Davison has great field position here with 10.52 left in the second quarter. We're right at midfield. First and 10, let's see if that offensive line can start creating some creases. Now we have Hay out there with Reed. 
Hay to the right in the slot. And they run that way. This is Reed. Nice run here. Picks up about 12 down near the 40. Actually gets to the 40. First and 10. Over his, in the last year, I believe, Tariq Reed has made 2,064 yards, running yards. He was a monster yards. last year for sure. Yeah. It looks like he's put on about 15 pounds of muscle this year too. Definitely one of the best Davison players. All right, we stay in the strong formation. Nope, actually now Hay goes all the way out to the slot. Hall inside to Reed. Cuts back against the grain. He's pushing that pile. Looks like he gains near seven down to the 33. It'll be second and three. <laughs> he says, feed me. Give me the ball some more. Second and short. Ten minutes exactly left here in the opening half. Southfield A&T leads 14-6. Reed directly behind Hall. Turns the wrong way. Broken play. Cuts back against the grain. This has got a chance to go a little bit. Ooh, cuts back again. Down to the 25 for another Cardinal. First down. <laughs> totally broken play. He turned to the right. Reed was running to his left. Good improvision there. Cannon comes from some uh, pretty tough blood. Roy Hall is dead, the wrestling coach. Now we've got a split formation. One running back to each side of Hall. He's going to throw it. Oh, geez, he picked him. Could see that coming. Defender was stepping right into the spot, and he just threw to a spot. So a turnover, the first turnover of the game belongs to Davison in a really bad spot on the field. Looked like we were going to go in for a score there. First and 10 for A&T at their own 23. Game's probably moving a little fast for Cannon at the moment until he gets his feet under him. Davison was lucky enough to have a three-year starter at quarterback. Doesn't happen very often in high school. Time for the defense to step up now with nine minutes left in the opening half. Motion across. Give us the other way to Fuqua. Nice tackle out there by Number 35 of the Cardinals, Logan Pasco. Stayed home like he's supposed to out there. Pick up of one, second and nine. Heavy on the right side here for a &T. That big old tight end in the backfield give up the no it's a pass and the tight end again slips out picks up out to the 27 it's going to be third and six for a and t it's the second time they've thrown the ball to him Southfield has like 40 cheerleaders. Maybe that's the varsity and the JVs out there both. Yeah, you can hear them all the way up here <laughs> in the press box. Third and six for a and Darby to throw. A lot of time going deep. Overthrown. Needed a little more air into that. Oh, here we go. Now we got another Davison penalty. 
Gilmore just picks up 15. Not good. Mm. Had him stop. Another personal foul. Really wish we had see substitutions on this stuff. Still in the game. Oh, now he's going. Man. Davison doesn't seem to be doing so hot, but still have some time. Well, to they come had him back. stop there. That's just just a not a headsy play. Yeah. Now they're throwing helmets. Wow, boy. Discipline, guys. First and ten now. A and T out to their own 42. Seven and a half left. This is Fuqua now. He's got running room here. Fumble the ball. It's loose, and it looks like it was recovered by number 18, Devin Baldwin of a &T. It's going to be second and short. Yep. Tight end again. He's everywhere. That wasn't the first down, was it? Hmm, maybe it was. Thought he was short of the markers. 18 now on the Davison side of the ball at the 48. Oh, big run here. Number 40, Blake Grice Brunson on the carry all the way down to the Davison 33. Going quick. Give to Brunson again. Oh, he's just punishing people. Tackled by. Number 35, Pasco, and number six, Fordham. Not before he picks up nine, though, down to the Davison, 24. This running back's a bruiser. Pass, quick flick. Got a man in space. Makes a miss and gets all the way down to the eight. Tackled from behind by Logan Pasco again, who's making a lot of stops. First and goal at the Davison eight with six minutes left here in the opening half. Southfield going fast. Oh, geez, Davison's got a guy offside. And there's a touchdown anyway. Fuqua is in the end zone. There's a flag, but it wasn't a dead ball. Or it should have been dead ball, actually. Man came onto the field late. So I think we're going to have to run that play again. But this time from the three. called a substitution infraction. So Southfield gets the touchdown and goes up 20 to six with 5.53 left here in the opening half. Lack of discipline cost that court, that touchdown right there. Had them stop. Yeah, Davison isn't doing so well today in defense. 
as an offense. A&T going for two again. Loaded up on the right side. Motion across now. Darby's going to keep it. And we got penetration and a fumble. And nope, the point is no good. So it's 20 to 6. Davison to receive the next kickoff. kicks. Look at that goal on those shoes. Unfortunately, we've seen those shoes go in the end zone twice already. <laughs> Must be the new craze. <laughs> those shoes just shine all the way up here. Mm -hmm. So they're kicking off from the 45. Must be the assess, the uh, illegal substitution penalty on the kickoff. Going deep, and that's going to be a touchback. Stefanko a little shaken up there. Looks like the Wayne State training staff is on hand too. The Cardinals, when they get the ball here, are going to start first and 10 on their own 20 and really need to get something in the end zone before halftime. They will get the opening kickoff in the second half as well. Looks like Stefanko has six or seven people out there mm -hmm. surrounding him. Looks this like Coach Zim is out there. This arm kind of get run over, bowled over, but he was acting like it was a leg, but the way they're looking yeah. at him, who knows? The way that he was all rolled up. We'll be home next Thursday night for the home opener against uh, the Oilers of Mount Pleasant. We got to make that drive last year. They get to return the favor this year. Thursday night again, Thursday night, just like tonight. Then we'll be back to our normal schedule after that. Another home game in week three. A 
been down a long time. Sitting up now. Maybe? Nope. Yep. Stefanko back on his feet now. He definitely looks wobbly. Looks like another possible concussion yeah, issue there. Being escorted out by some other trainer and coach. Officials. And the Wayne State people are following him. Yep. So Davis has the ball first and 10. At their 20, there's 5.53 left here in the opening half. Had a little momentum on offense last time and then turned the ball over with the interception. And then a really big personal foul on the last defensive possession when the uh, ANT was stopped. Hall on the gun, gives it to Reed. Driving a little bit, gets out to the 23. Second and seven. Second and seven, we've got a full house here. Hall keeps it and gets smothered. No gain. Third down. Did not take that fake. They are attempting to make a lot of good plays, but not executing them well. Hay goes off for a response. Four and a half minutes left here in the opening half. A&T calls timeout. Their second of the half. Coach didn't like something there. So Davison's schedule, we have Mount Pleasant home next week, and then the following week, week three, we have Carmen Ainsworth at home, which will be a huge game to start the early portion of the season. Hopefully great weather like today. <laughs> not too hot, not too cold. Sure. Although others might disagree down there. Beautiful night. All right, third and long for the cards. See if Hall can make a connection here. I'm not sure we have a completed pass yet. Rolls to his left. Throws on the run and dropped. Good throw. Hit Roland right in the hands, but it was a little bit of a wobbler. 
and wasn't able to pull it in. That would have been a first down. Instead, Davison will punt, and A&T has time. 4.18 left here in the second quarter. Pressure on the defense for sure right now. Halt punt. Whoa, high snap. Good catch. Wow, there's a hold right there. Lamar Hay just plants the A&T runner. Returned by number 17, Saunders Carter. And A&T will take over on their 42 with four minutes and eight seconds left here in the opening half. Darby turns and gives it. Oh, kept his feet. Nice balance. Pick up a five. Franklin, Leon Franklin on the carry. Stumbled a bit, but kept his feet. Give up the middle again. Nice tackle there. On the feet was number 24, that's Gabe Ellis. Picks up maybe two. It'll be third down and two. Southfield going tempo again. Oh, nice stop in the backfield. Gabe Ellis again, this time for a loss of three. And the defense does its job and forces a punt. Yeah, the defense is doing a lot better in the second quarter than in the first. Watch for a fake here. Fourth and four, four near midfield. Roland deep for the cards. Flags. Well, I hope that's not offsides. That'll be a first down. Procedure on South Field. Roland has joined. Deep by number 17, Caleb Smith. Moving again. Another procedure. Yeah. The white guy on this side moved. Well, this will give us a little better field position. Two and a half minutes left. Oh, good punt. Deep punt. Oh, go get the ball. Oh. Really nice punt all the way down to the Davison 17. And I got to believe we're going to play it pretty close to the vest here. Still looking for our first completed pass, I believe.
Widen the split on each side. Hall awaiting the snap. Keeps it. Got a first down, and he's got some more. Good speed oh. shown there. Down to the south field, 44, I believe, where they'll mark him. Oh, we got a hold. It's coming back. Mm. Boy, we just one step forward and three steps back. Wipes out the first down. But it'll be first and two as the ball was marked back to the 25. <laughs> two minutes left here in the opening half. This time it's Reed. He's got some yardage. Good for a first down out to the 31. Hall keeps. No place to go here. Smothered under at the line of scrimmage. And the clock will run. Davison still has two timeouts. Choosing not to use them. It's like Coach Zimmerman just trying to get into halftime. Second and 10 at the 31. Hall on the inside screen. Oh, here we got some room. Got to break a tackle. That's Anthony Fordham. Gets down to the south field, 47. No flags on the field. Davis is still holding on to those timeouts. 106 left here in the half. Yeah, the clock will start as soon as it's ready for play. A little urgency here, guys. Hauling the gun. Looking to throw it. Now he's running for his life. Whoa, horse tackle. Not a horse collar. Oh, there's a flag on now Zimmerman. He's lost his cool. And another flag. He's gone. He's gone. He's been ejected from the game. Two personal fouls. Davison is not too happy about that. Well, there was a it was a pretty obvious yeah. horse collar tackle and it wasn't called, but yeah. Coach really lost his cool. You can hear them booing from down there. So who will assume the coaching duties? He's got to leave the field. I don't know if that means he sits next week, too. I'm not sure. That's not good. They I don't really, know what the rule is there. They really need him. I know with a player in ejection, you lose the next game.
So 30-yard penalty walked off there. Two unsportsmanlike conducts. He has to leave the facility. He can't even be anywhere near the field. So this isn't exactly the way Davison wanted their season to start. There are 17 seconds left, and the clock is running. So this, I don't know if we're going to run a play. We do. It's Reed. Oh. Uh, unfortunately, gets run out of bounds. Just a few more seconds. Now we have, we have a flag way back here. It's coming back anyway. It's, there's a hold here. It's the same official. That's it for the half. So we'll be back for the second half in about 15 minutes. All right, Randy, the way that first half ended, we are going to see what kind of character the Cardinals have. We have uh, the head coach has been dismissed from the game. There were several personal fouls, and it's time now for the seniors to decide how the season is going to go starting right now. Yeah, I mean, listen, a lot of turmoil at the end of that first half. And, and your, for your first game, after coming off such a successful season, yep. you know, they have, these guys, a lot of these guys haven't faced adversity. It's right. time now. It sure is. Mm -hmm. 
So we found out that Coach Blaze is going to be down on the sidelines, kind of holding it down over there. Um, so we'll see how he does, see if he can calm the crew down, get them refocused on this second half, because truthfully, this game's still winnable. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, it would have been nice to pick up a score there right before half, but, you know, penalties, big plays, yeah, a couple penalties. Of, couple of big, couple of big penalties. Yep, definitely. Yep. So we'll see. It's a young crew, but this is how they learn. Yep. Da Davison gets the ball first here. Mm -hmm. oh, saw a couple dynamic performances at halftime there with the uh, Holy moly. Southfield and Davison band, the Southfield dance crew there. That was oh, that was spectacular. Yeah, man. I'm like, wow, these guys are these guys are tearing it up. It like they could have been in a Beyonce show or something. Oh. <laughs> it was good. <laughs> Wish I would have recorded it. Yeah, yeah, they, they kind of <laughs> took it by storm out there. They own that field. They sure did. That might be the best performance of the night out there. <laughs> it, it has been so far. <laughs> Good stuff. All right. Got to love high school sports. Yeah, it's, it, it really brings out the best in a lot of people. All right, we've got about a minute before we huddle up for the second half kickoff. I wouldn't look for us to change our game plan too much um, strategy-wise. You know, uh, the, Tariq started to get a few seams there, you know, towards the end. I think you keep feeding him, maybe hit rolling on one or two. You bust one, and, and we can see what happens here. Really important to try and have something really positive happen here on this opening drive. I think that'll, that'll help settle everybody in, mm -hmm. get things back under control. No doubt, no doubt. Bad new the good news is we got a lot of former head coaches on that coaching staff, so it's not, it's not a big deal to step into the reins. No, they've called plays before in a, in a winning situation. They've yep. been down on there. Very tumultuous end of the first half, though. Wow. Mm -hmm. Haven't seen that in Davis in football in a long time. No, no. It's been a, been a pretty well-oiled machine. So let's see how Southfield comes out, too. Are they going to come out cocky and overconfident? We'll see. Yeah. Yeah, there'll be definitely the tale of two halves here now. We'll see. See if Davidson can make it this on their half, make it count here. Right. I don't see anybody with their head down. No, no, they seem to be kind of ready to go. Um, they'll probably squib it here again. So um, it'd be nice if it bounced up a little bit and uh, and Roland could get his hands on this one. So you got Lamar right in the middle there. That's a good thing. Mm hmm. All right, Gilbert to kick off for NT. Roland's deep, but he's not seen a kickoff yet. Here comes the second half, y'all. Bounces past the first line. Oh, got some hole here. Not sure exactly. I think we had. Yeah, I think Smith? it was Caleb Smith yep. who's the. One of the deep backs on the punt returns. That yeah. was. Oh, we got a soft field player hurt on the first play. It's like a shoulder and arm there. Yeah. Hate to speculate, but he's sitting up, so hopefully he's okay. Because we've seen a couple players down also. This, yeah, this I don't game. know that we did. We see Cal Stefanko at all back after he was injured. I don't think so. I haven't seen him yet. I'd be surprised if he did. Yeah, that, he was down a long time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Special teams always tough for injuries. Always tough. Yeah, everybody's going full speed to try and kill each other. Yeah, exactly. Uh, but a nice little gator there for uh, Caleb Smith up the middle. Had a nice little little hole and got, got a few yards in that. Probably yeah, Davidson's going to start out near midfield, so mm -hmm. that's a good good starting spot. Mm -hmm. Crowd still hanging around. Got the Detroit night is in full effect at this sure point. Sure is. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. yep. Lights have taken over full on. Sun is nowhere to be seen. So let's see. Davison comes out. Mm, they're coming out in their non without without the two backs. Mm -hmm. So we're back to the f set we started the game with. Split in a wide on both sides and just rolling. And Hall in the backfield. And the first give is to Austin, and he is smothered. Mm -hmm. Actually loses two. Back to the 40. Yep. Boy, the, they just came unabated. Yeah, I don't think uh, anybody got a body on anybody that play. The whole left side of that line kind of disappeared. Turned to red really quick. Davison's determined to run it. Mm -hmm. And Southfield's beating him to the punch at the moment. Quick 
slant out here. Oh, this is a nice pickup there by Austin Rowland. Makes a couple guys miss, picks up maybe 16 there. Yeah, it's a good pass, good safe pass for Canada too to try to get some, uh, Cannon Hall to get a little confidence back after throwing a pick in the first. That's right. So a good little safe little seam pass there. and uh, Give him 14, he's at the 45 of the Warriors of Southfield A&T. It's nice to have edge weapons, I tell you that. First down and 10 at the 45. Hopefully Cannon is able to settle in now too. Game probably started a little fast for him. Yeah, he threw a pick on a slant play where the defender just made a good play on it. But uh, yeah, He was stepping. I could watch. He was walking mm -hmm. right into that spot. Mm -hmm. Another pass. It's a floater out to Roland. Nice. Makes a nice catch. Makes a man miss. Picks up 10 more. Another first down. Really nice touch on that ball from Cannon. Got it. Just lofted it up for the back to get underneath it. And it, uh, another first down. Another first down. It looks like Reed's got maybe an equipment problem. Not sure exactly what he was pointing at there. The he's staying out there, though. Davison on its opening possession of the second half. One minute in. Down a couple of scores. They stay spread. Hall looking to throw it. He's got a man over the middle. Oh, he was wide open, and it was just kind of missed. Yeah. I, I Max Slazak. The ball was a little high, but it looked like the, the receiver should have made a play on that yeah, one. Yeah, I think he just kind of had his timing screwed up there. He mm -hmm. was just wide open sitting down. That would have been, uh, actually, if he throws it in his chest, that could have been six. Yeah, absolutely. Nobody yeah, was nobody was guarding him. Mm -hmm. Really good protection on that play, too. Line slid, slid him out to the left, and uh, and Hall yeah, rolled yeah, out. Everybody has their eye on Roland, so mm -hmm. where he goes, three or, three or four defenders go, too. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised to see that play again here um, in the next situation where it fits. Because that was definitely one we can we can go back to. Second and ten. Davison is at the south field 34. Gifts to Reed. Tries to break the corner. Does. Got some more. Down to the about the 18 yard line. I think they're going to have him. Mark it on the 17. Yeah, three or 14 yard pickup. Three or four plays later, and we are in striking distance. This is a great start to the second half for the Absolutely. Cardinals. Got to get six. Boy, I'm not sure about our kicking game. It's a little. <laughs> you never know until you line up for the first one, right? The last three years, we were so blessed. We had such consistency. Yeah, Graham Hungerford, he was, a, he was, he was very, very reliable. Now kicking at uh, Davenport. Mm -hmm. First and ten, Davison sits on the 17-yard line of Southfield A&T. Go back to the run here. Roland again, or I mean, uh, <laughs> Reed up the middle. Mm -hmm. Just picks what he can down to the 15. Second and eight. A couple minutes gone in the third quarter. Davison knocking on the door here. Second and eight from about the uh, 15, 14. Right on the 15. Right on the 15. Staying in that same set. Man coverage on the outside. Both sets. Hall to throw. He's got a man right down the middle. Oh, nice catch. What a beautiful catch. There it is. Touchdown Number 16, Davis. Garrett Goyette. That was underthrown, but Garrett Goyette goes down to the turf and picks it up. Hall threw that against the grain. He was rolling to his yeah, right. Yeah, very difficult throw. Threw back left, but he had just enough on it, and the receiver uh, yep. made a great play. Adjusted yeah. and made a great play. Generally, you can't get enough on the ball going that way, and that's mm -hmm. oftentimes when picks happen too, but mm -hmm. nice play all around, and that is exactly what the Cardinals needed to start the second half. There we go. Going to go for two. It is 20 to 12. We got 9.56 left in the third. We're just underway here. Davison scores on its opening possession. Oh, uh, we got movement. Ah, man. Yeah, can't do that, man. We need these So points. many mental errors tonight. Now you have to throw it. Yeah, definitely going to have to put it in the air here. I'm pretty sure that's where they're going to go to. Let's see what they got now. Ball back to the eight. 
for this two-point attempt. Remember, the defense can score if something weird happens. All to throw. Oh, he's in. Oh, screen play. Oh, we got it. Might got a seam here. No, no, not enough. Couldn't sustain it long. If the snap was high, he was on his heels. Yeah, that was a little bit of a busted screen play. It was yeah. a good idea, I think, but yeah. uh, not executed strongly in, the, in week one. You got to got to work on those a few more times in practice. So Davis and down eight now, 20 to 12, but they get some points. Their first since the opening uh, possession of the first uh, first half for them. So, Well, we questioned how they were going to come out, and so far, so, so good. So far, so good. We'll see what the defense does. Absolutely. I don't know if you've seen them. you see these gigantic buckets of French fries they're selling down here? No, I haven't. <laughs> these people, I, I can them. smell them, but I haven't <laughs> yeah. seen them. Well, I see, and I see the tent over yeah. here. That's very <laughs> that must be it. Look yep. at the pizzas under the light oh, there, too. Man. I'm kind of hungry. I, I am, too, man. So that's why I brought up those fries. It's been a long time fries. since lunch. <laughs> and I'll tell you, the, the calories you burn walking up to the press box here, <laughs> lots of steps. Just lots of a calories. few more steps than Cardinal Stadium, and they're all half steps. <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> Kick goes deep, take it at the five. Nice open field tackle out there by number two, Ray Cole, one of our defensive backs. Having to in about a 13-yard gain, but... Uh, oh, flags everywhere. Oh, here we go. On who now? Hopefully it's on them. There have been enough of those personal fouls on us. Yeah, it'd be nice to see one the other way. Half the distance here. If it's against Southfield, we've got no indication yet from this referee. Yeah, he's not, a, he's not a high energy guy. No, he's not. He's taking his time with he's everything. Definitely here. not a high energy guy. <laughs> it looks like they are. Here we go. We're going to get a signal. Personal foul this time against Southfield. All right. So move that ball back. All right. Nine yards yeah. to the nine. He's on the kickoff, so it'll still be first and ten. All right, this would be a great spot to get a stop, pin them deep, and get the ball back at good field position. Yeah, play the field position game a little bit here. Three well, they've out. got a couple of that number 40, Brunson, just a bruising back. They've used mm -hmm. four tailbacks. <laughs> yeah, keeping them fresh. This looks like the Fuqua. Mm -hmm. Darby trying to draw us off sides. Mm -hmm. Lots of receivers to the wide side of the field. Against the green. Oh, oh boy. That was Fuqua, and he just delivers the blows. Yeah. Yep. And uh, they set that play up nicely. They had really wide splits between the center and the guard there, and that's right where he ran it. They uh, went trips yeah. to the opposite All side. All the motion's going away, yeah. and they're cutting against the green. He picks up seven. It's going to be second and three, and they're going, they're going with tempo again. Mm-hmm. Same wide splits between the center and guard there. Let's see if they, they come back Look to the center. Look at that tight end in the backfield. Man, he's yeah. a big boy. The same play. Same play. Same exact play. Same result. Yeah. Picks up seven again and a first down. Yeah, we're going to have to do something to close that, that, that gap down right there. I haven't seen us blitzing at all tonight. No, no, and you wonder if that's because of the youth speed. of the team. Yeah, yeah it might speed. be because of speed they're yeah. against, too. Yeah, you don't want to get beat deep on a big play. Southfield works his way out to their own 21. Nine minutes left here in the third quarter. Davison back to within eight. Looking for a stop. This is Fuqua again, right up the middle. Oh, no, this is the bigger guy. This is Brunson. Brunson, he gets it all the way out to the 40. Big run there, and you can see, you can see Ooh. Ray he didn't, Cole getting He didn't up make it to slow. the 43. Yeah. He was tackled at the 40, but <laughs> five-man crew. I did, can't figure out how the officiating works. Some places you go, there's a seven-man crew. Other places, it's five. Yeah, I know, and you spoke about it earlier, the, the aging uh, yeah, officials. These guys are all old guys. Yeah. There's not a single. There's Brunson again. They're just gashing us. Yeah, this is gaping holes right up the middle here. This is football 101 here. Nine yards. Just keep going tempo, right to the ball, right to the line of scrimmage, and away they go. Not much reading going on. No, it's just simple, straight up the gut. Stop me if you can. 
Fuqua again, this time to the left. Yeah, Bounces outside. Here. Good play there, but it still gets his first down. Mm -hmm. Down to the 40, looks like they've got him at the 43 of Davis and first and 10. Mm -hmm. All right, tighten the chin straps, boys. They're coming right after you. Yeah, and you're not going to see any passes until mm -hmm. we can prove we can stop the run. Yeah. Ooh, high snap, controlled nicely. Fuqua again. This time we get a stop yep. after pick up a two. Yep. Interior lineman there got off his block nicely and made that stop. Get to him early. That's what you got to do. Wrap yep. him up, get to him early. McCarn now back in at the running back, number 32. They do cycle him in and out. Yeah. So it's been four guys back there. This is McCarn. Oh, it's a little pass. Oh, boy, there's nobody out there. That's the tight end again. <laughs> Brought down from behind. He's just as big, if not bigger, than those running backs. Yep. Brought down yeah. from behind by Garrett Goyette. Yeah, this is a nicely orchestrated drive by, by Southfield. Sure is. That play action had everybody fooled, and now they're in scoring position inside the 20. Including the announcer. That's the second time the same play I've bit on the fake, just like our defense. And we got an overhead view. <laughs> <laughs> For sure. Quarterback pulling his receiver up to the line there. This is McCarn. Ooh, that looked like a face mask. Mm -hmm. Gets down to the 15. Chitty knocks him down, picks up only one that time at second and nine. They're staying with the tempo. No huddling going on. Mm. Trying to wear out this defense early in the third. 6.44, clock just rolling along. This is the one they usually run against the green. Mm -hmm. Yeah, got the trips over to the left side to see if they come back here to the right with the running back. And there he, it is. Nope. He just cut back against mm -hmm. it. You can see nothing there. Yep. Yeah, they had that play set up, but yeah, he cut it back. Not nice open field tackle there by number 35, Logan Pasco. All right, big play here, third down now. Third down from from the 10. They're definitely in four door four down territory here. It's third and four. Make a stop here and make them really think about it on fourth. That's what we got to do here. They're probably going for it, but you want to make them get that pressure of having it be fourth. The Bruisers and, oh, no, this is another one. Keelan Green now, a different running back at tailback. Leads me to believe they're going to the air here. Oh, oh. movement. Yeah, that looked like it was going to be a keeper, actually. Yep. Actually, it's Leon Franklin who's the tailback now, number 33. So we're down a third and long now, third and nine looks like. After the penalty. Keep an eye on that um, tight end. Yeah, he's been their go-to guy. He is so big. <laughs> There he is, sitting on this right half back there. 39, they've got to make the six. Throw from Darby. Pressure coming. Not pressure. They nice got pressure. him. They got him down this time. All right, a nice sack. Oh, don't jump on late. Don't jump on late. Oh, don't do that stuff. Yeah. Great play. Defense, uh, Davidson defense stepping up there. And now it's going to be fourth and very long. From the 20, and they're not going to kick a field goal from the 19. Yeah, they're definitely going for this. Pin your ears back, boys. Get that pass rush for the second straight time here. Yeah, and keep an eye on the tight end. Yeah, definitely make sure he doesn't get open in the flat because that's trouble. Extra defensive back comes in. Ray Cole. One of the linebackers out. 
Looks like the tight end may be out too. Baldwin may be out. We're on this really play. deep on the slot. Oh, now we're stepping up a little. Yeah. Timeout by who? Looks like Davis. Davison. Okay, good call there. Yep. Get to get the troops together. It's a very big play. You stop them here. We're one score down. This Absolutely. Is, this is huge. Blaze calling those guys together over there. Mm -hmm. See what we got going on. Yep. Yeah, you hate to use it. Uh, a timeout. Time out. Yeah, you mm -hmm. hate to use it on defense, but. You know, hey, if this, this could be a play that keeps you in the game. There are four minutes and 26 seconds left here in the third. 20 to 12, a and over the Cardinals of Davison. Opening night. I'm just going to throw this caveat out there. The, the Davison kids have been in school all week. Yep. These Southfield kids are not yet back in school. You're right. All right. So, so you know, we're, we're a little brain drain right now. That's, <laughs> that, that's my take on this thing. All right. <laughs> Actually, it probably means we should be sharper at this point, huh? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> that logic could be used against me. Mm -hmm. Well, it's just a lot of it's just difference in speed. Mm-hmm. We're holding our own at the moment. Here we go. This is a huge play for the Cardinals. Fourth down. Let's see if we get some pressure up Got to reach the six. Darby throw. Here comes pressure. Oh, down he goes. There it is. Big Oh, snap. Gabe Ellis. Gabe Ellis straight up the middle. Didn't get touched. Get off the field, guys. Yes. Thank you. This is not the Super Bowl, kids. Get off. <laughs> get off the field. Oh, especially with the way those uh, those yellow flags yeah, are popping out of pockets. Yeah, those guys are not really our fans at the moment. That's no. for sure. Yeah. So Davison takes over on downs with a chance with a score and a two-pointer to get this game tied up. Uh, penalty, then two straight sacks gets Davison out of the hole. Yeah, that penalty was huge. Yeah, it looked like Southfield was going to punch it in for sure yep. with a third and third and four, third and five, and bam, there you go. Tide changes. All right, here we go. Now we're back to the uh, two-back set. Hay is out there with Reed. Ooh, jumping? No, nope. didn't call it. Everybody's looking at the wristbands. Yeah, tight ends peeking in to get a call. <laughs> there he goes, peeks at his wristband. There we go. This is a keeper by Hall, and he's smothered up. Yeah. Nothing there. Can't go in there straight up. That's a <laughs> dangerous play. You might learn that one. Uh, he was kind of standing straight up going through that hole. It's amazing how technology has changed. Yep. We're looking at the Davidson coaches, and they got yeah, Eric's in there with a tablet. <laughs> we got a laptop. Yeah, he's watching plays on demand as they happen in here. He can play yep. them back, and yeah, it's the long days from shouting down from a press box. Absolutely. Huh? Mm -hmm. All right, guys, let's go. This is Reed. Nothing there either. Yeah. That guy came right Collapse in the there. middle. Yeah. It's going to be third and ten. Going to require a pass. Yeah, I think we're going to get out of that two-back look right here. This is where we're having the most success so far. Yep. I don't know. Yeah. Hay is still out there, so okay. we're staying that way. Third and 10, third and 11 actually for Davison. Need to reach the 37. There's been people open downfield. Hall to throw it, he has some time. He's going deep down the sideline. He's got Roland, oh, and went through his hands. That was a great throw. Oh, he, that was 50 to 60 yards in the air. All that the way to the 25 from the 25. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, 50 yards 50 in yard the air. pass in the air. Wow, and it was perfectly thrown. Right between the hands. Would have taken line. a great catch, but it was it was right there. Yeah. Um, <laughs> if we can get those throws connected, we're, we're going to have a, a better year than it looks like. That was really close. Mm. Nonetheless, we got a three and out situation here. Mm. Yep. Um, so we're going to have to hold that saw, um, you know, the bend but no break, you know, do that again on the south field defense because they're moving the ball. I'd like to see... Cannon punt the ball away from this guy instead of straight at him. Punt it to one of the sidelines or the other. 
Yeah, give it to him at midfield, but don't let him run it back. Straight up the middle. Yeah. Oh, we got a hole fair right there. Too, yeah. And a fair catch called right. at the 43, where Southfield will take over. Nice coverage. Nice coverage on that one. Terry was in his face right as he caught it. Good high kick, yeah. too. Mm -hmm. Looks like our ball boy isn't the ball boy. He's a ball man. <laughs> They're getting older, <laughs> huh? All right, A&T starts with good field position here. 241. Again! Look at that. This time by number 44, Trevor Brown. That's three consecutive plays with sacks. The defense is really keying in on their passing now. Loses eight back to the 35. Hmm. Can't figure out why they're going away from the running game. Uh, they're so successful with it. Yeah, I would not right. be throwing until I Sometimes coaches me. get greedy. Yeah, I think so. Yep. Mm. Well, it's working in our favor right now. Keep keep calling those pass plays. Absolutely. We, Let's do it again. Yeah, we got a pass rush for that. There's that counter. Oh, he missed the tackle. Nice play in the open field there by Fordham. Fuqua out to the 45, though. Nice pickup. Picks up 10. Yeah, It'll be third and eight. The play before, Brown came in nicely on the pass, got the sack. This time he came in and missed that tackle. They had their heads down. He went right past him with the ball. That, yep. that Another missed tackle on the edge there. Easy, guys. Yeah. Easy. All these big pileups are adding in an extra shove or two on yeah, both sides. Yeah, the whistles are a little slow coming mm -hmm. on that stuff, which just causes problems. Yeah. First and 10 on the Davison 42. Boy, Davis, Davison had him in the hole there. Let him out. Mm-hmm. Stacking the receivers on the right now. Fuqua again up the middle. Quarterback keeps. Boy, oh. and there's another missed tackle. Yeah. We're just a second behind on a lot of those tackles. Looks like we need a turnover. Yeah, that's uh, that's going to be our blessing here. If it comes, if it comes. It's We're there. We're there at the point of attack. We're just not mm -hmm. getting them down. Yeah. Let's see if we can get them to put one on the carpet here. That. Uh, Big tight end Baldwin checks back in. Last 40 seconds of the third quarter. Oh, that time. Oh, oh another miss. He's going to score. Oh, he did score. He's in. Is he in? He rode, a guy, rode in on a guy's back. That there. should be a touchdown. Yeah, it should be, but I think they're going to call him down at the one. Somebody hurt. Well, he came really close to being down early in that run, but he stayed on his feet. That was a touchdown. Yeah, he did. Ride he rode in on the guy's back. He never touched the ground. Yeah, definitely. Ref's going to call him down at the one, though, so we still get another chance to keep him out. First and goal. Leon Franklin gets rewarded with a second carry, and he's in the end zone. Yeah, no doubt about it that time. So Southfield answers from the second and 18, in they go, and it goes back to a two-score game. Southfield a little bigger, a little faster. At the moment, it's showing its showing its head for sure. Mm -hmm. Going to go two again, I think. this time. Last 17 seconds to be played here. The wind is basically, and there's a little bit of movement out there, but it's pretty pretty much settled down. Yeah, it was definitely stronger earlier in the day. Sun went down, wind kind of fell with it. All right, the big bruiser is back in there. Brunson 
At the, oh, oh well, we, we got to delay, delay a game. game yeah, yeah, they were taking way too long on that. They're not used to huddling. <laughs> Try will come from the eight. Still trying to get the play in. Yeah, they're uh, they're having some trouble with this call. Yeah. See, we got a guy on his own up there. See, we got a slant at the top. Mm -hmm. Nope, now we put a man in motion too. Going the other, other way on the way slant. The it was ball bounced that in. Get, yep. That ball bounced in. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, okay, yeah. That's a great thing about that field turf. You can always see it when it skids. Yeah. <laughs> All right, 26 to 12. Uh, Davidson's going to have to put on their comeback hat. We're going to have one quarter to do it. We're almost done with this one. A few seconds remaining. All right, this could get exciting, though. Maybe we'll see um, open up some of those 50-yard bombs there by uh, <laughs> Mike Candle. Let's see what he's made of here. Yeah. Let's see, you know, see if we can connect on one or two of those. Maybe not quite yet, but, uh, you know, it gets down to, down to crunch time. We were talking earlier about the schedule. Um, yeah, we're kind of first game away, then we're, we're, we're top heavy with the home games. Yeah, and then uh, and then I think we're away to, to end the season as well. Yep. So uh, yeah. a little different schedule for us. Only four home games as well this year, same as we had last year. So. Yeah, because of this one. Yeah, yeah, this one here, yep. It's cool to be a part of something like this. Absolutely. Yep, uh, kids get, a, get on a bigger stage, get to feel it a little bit. Hard to do it in week one. Yeah. Um, but uh, but it's definitely an experience they're going to remember. That's good, too. You're playing good competition, so you kind of get a feel for where you stand at the moment. Yeah. A lot of things change between week one and week two. That is the absolute truth. Ooh, that could go out of bounds. Oh, yeah. touched oh, it now. Yeah. That took a real funny spin. Ooh, man, he was hit helmet to helmet. That was Carson McLaughlin on the return for the Cardinals. Going to start here at about the 40. Looks like it right on it. Hmm. Southfield running some guys out there two ways, I see. Baldwin also uh, doubles as a defensive player. That's a pretty good roster, too. Yeah. A lot of guys on the sideline. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you don't see them as full as they used to be, man. High school no. football teams used to go fill up that whole player's box, but yep. uh, they seem to be shrinking as the this years is, go. This is, quite frankly, of the teams we normally play, that's about as big of a roster as you're going to see on the sideline. Yeah, absolutely. All right, Hall, he's got two running backs with him, and this is Reed, and that's going to do it for the third quarter. So we're going to go into the fourth quarter down 26-12 here at Wayne State University in the Zenith kickoff classic we'll see what the fourth quarter will bring us hopefully some better fortune yeah. play that quarter even but that doesn't do it when you're down by two scores kind of a weird stadium the press box sits out into the stand so if you're if you're sitting higher than the press box you can't see the the one end of the field that's opposite you yeah it makes me makes me think they maybe added or made the, the press box bigger at some point yeah because it's it doesn't yeah the press box comes right out in the middle and you're yeah. we're like uh, 12 rows out yeah <laughs> I was sitting there earlier I couldn't see the other end of the field or the scoreboard I had to yep. keep leaning forward yeah, not the best design. But I'll tell you something I noticed. I was up at um, uh, Northwood University this weekend, mm -hmm. and uh, all these, all these, even the Division II schools have these indoor practice facilities now for football. Yep. It's amazing. I mean, yeah. wow. All right, second and six Cardinals on their own 44. A 
Reed tries to cut back and is met for no gain. Okay, we can't go three and out on this drive, fellas. No. Got to pick up a first down. Actually, they show him as losing a yard. Okay. I'd look for him to roll out Cannon here again, see if he can get something, a little dumper or, or something to, to get us in a flat open. Off goes Hay. In comes Fordham. Extra receiver. Our friends in Lapeer were opening with Clarkston tonight. Well, that's not an easy matchup either. Well, they knocked him out last year just like us in the playoffs. Whoa, he's under pressure. And he has a man open. Caught once again by Max Slazak. Picks up his first grab of the evening. And it's a first down, Randy. Yeah, nice completion there. I think Cannon Hall here is starting to get his, you know, get his wits about him, and he's making good plays, good decisions down the field now. All right, keeps this drive alive. Got to score. We're going to have to score every time we touch the ball from here on yeah, out. Yeah, I, I can see that being the fact. Because we don't usually score in a minute or anything. It takes us a bit of time. Yeah. Was there nobody? Okay, there he comes. I thought we had a guy wide open out there. <laughs> thought Fordham was open, but they slid a guy out. All to throw him. it against the screen. Yep, there it is. Oh, he's got himself on an island, and he makes a couple of guys miss. That's Reed down to the 33. Uh, Reed in space is. Oh, oh no. and now we have another we penalty. Go. Oh, I think Which that's. one? I don't know. I hope it's not on us, but it may be. It looks like 75. Travis. He got one earlier in the game. Yeah, but he thinks it's, he thinks it's against them. Oh, it could be. Well, that would be nice. Walk that ball down to the 19. Take that. Yep. All right. It's going that way. Down to the 19. Good, good, good. Okay, so I penalties mean, are starting to come around a little bit. Yeah. Ever since the end of that first half, we 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 seem to have our heads in the right spot, playing football now. Let Southfield make those mistakes now. Boy, read in space. Is that something to watch? Mm. <laughs> There's three guys in yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and none of them touched him until he was 10 yards downfield. Yeah, you, know, you almost know he's going to make the first guy miss, and usually the second as well. And this time he made three. And these are guys with speed and agility. Yeah, yeah. These guys are not slouching out there. Yep. First and ten at the 19 for the Cards. Read again. Got a hole here. Oh, it breaks a man, miss. Oh, just couldn't quite get him off his legs. Uh, that was going to go. Yeah, it was definitely. Knocked him off balance just a little bit, maybe grabbed his ankle. Oh, we got a hurt player for Southby holding the knee. Yeah. He was getting up now. Looks like he's just a little sugar. Oh, there he goes. Got on his feet. That's good. Yeah, got on him quick. Good. So, <laughs> I, do I hear... I hear Mr. Brown cheer from the band. I think I think I just heard a hi, Mr. Brown cheer from the band out here. <laughs> <laughs> I saw him and Mr. Beamer I, out I'm there. I'm sure right he right. is probably. <laughs> <laughs> I think Superintendent Liskey is here too somewhere. Yeah, we got a good good contingent, man, of administrators and school board members like yourself, Mr. <laughs> Lindsay. Yeah. By the way, while we got some time here, thank you very much for, for what you do. And I don't just on the school board, but you've been coming out of these games since, what, 2000, doing these games? Since up in the we moves? started doing them, me and Jim Shepard from Collins yeah. Field, where we were shuttling tapes from the field to the to the production <laughs> studio. Unbelievable. It's been huh? a blast. It has. Good stuff. Yeah, thank you guys very much, man, for making this, making this happen for us. And we still have our troubles from time to time, like tonight, <laughs> but... But it's because we're pushing ourselves That's now, right. though. You know, tomorrow or uh, next week, you can be sure we're we're going to be all set. And we're going to have our cameras ready, and and we'll be live. All to throw it. Second and four. He's going deep in the corner. Oh boy, Great it was a good play. job. Uh, that was almost intercepted, and it was almost then caught by. Oh, he's hurt too. Oh, is that Fordham? Is that Fordham? I think it is. Six, yeah. Oh, he's he's okay. It. And that looks like that was number six, uh, Rush, I think. Yeah, Rush. Coach. He's he, been in on a lot of stuff for them, too. Boy, he played that textbook, you know. Yep. He got his head around, made a play on the ball. Yep. yep. Both of them were fighting for it. Mm -hmm. Big down big down here. Third down, Davis, and definitely going to go if they don't make it here. Got to punch one in here, guys. Going back to the two backs. Third 
We haven't seen Hay carry the ball yet either. Mm -mm. Reed trying to cut against the grain. No, nice play there. Two guys pushing on him. Looks like he's going to be a couple yards short. Fourth and two, maybe. Let's see where the spot is. Needs to make the nine. Got him at the 12. So fourth and three. Biggest play of the game right here for the Cardinals. They've got to pick this up. No doubt. Gabe Ellis out there now on offense. See what they do here. I wouldn't be surprised if they try to get the ball to Reed somehow, some way here. Looks like they're trying to bring in stacking up that. Yeah, they're going with the full, full house backfield here. This mm -hmm. is what we normally see in goal line situations. Yep. Uh, looks like there's a little indecision in, with the guys. Oh, and Southfield wants a timeout. timeout. Good. They. Yeah, I don't think they've seen this full house look from yep. us today, so they were they were a little taken back. No. So they burn their first of the second half. Both teams have two remaining. Yeah, both teams burned them both on defense, too. True. Hmm. And that's going to come into play here if we go down to the wire. Um, the game just before us, that went down to the wire. Um, to the last play. Yeah. Uh, Wald Lake West and uh, Bloomfield Hills came right down to the last play. So good night of football here in downtown Detroit. Yeah. Two games tomorrow on this field and then three on Saturday. Headlining with uh, Cast Tech playing a team from Indianapolis in, yeah. the, fi in the finale. Yeah, that Cast Tech team is something to see. We um, they have like eight Division One players on. It's crazy. Yeah, we actually had the uh, uh, um, we had the uh, fortune of calling both of their semifinal games last year uh, for the MSHA. Yeah. And uh, you want to talk about a team with athletics and and size? Mm -hmm. That team will will take you back. Mm -hmm. But they did lose, lose their big gun to Michigan there, uh, Donovan Peoples there. Right. Yeah, he's uh, he's now, he'll be playing on Saturdays. Okay, now we've come out with a different set. We're into our normal spread set here. A couple of wide receivers, a couple of slots. And it's just Tariq Reed back there with Cannon Hall. So from the full house to the spread, we're, we're changing it up on him. Oh, he's wide open. Yes, go forward. I thought he was going to come backwards. Just go forward. You've already got a first down. All the way to the four. It's first and goal. He took that stutter step inside. What's he thinking? <laughs> oh, he's hurting. Oh, no, you see, okay. he's really limping. That's Fordham. Uh, yeah, he's, he's shaking it up. Got off. hurt on that play. Yep. Might four have, in the corner of the end zone. Yep, yep. That might have been the one. Okay, well, first down and goal. Here we go. 10-07. Davison looking to get another score here. Cardinals will not give up. They are not letting this one get away from them. Telling me a lot about themselves. Yes. Southfield's looking to blitz here, I believe. Yeah. Bringing him in off the corners. Reed up the middle, jumps the line of scrimmage, and scores it. All right. 9.39 left. Davison gets another six. We've got to get a two-point conversion done. That was a nice uh, move by Reed, but I got Jump the line of scrimmage? Yeah. I got to tell you, they, they cut block. They submarined them up front. Great job by the offensive Everybody line. went down because yep. the, the defense is going to go down low. They're trying to take away all the gaps by just putting their body in the hole, yep. and they just crumble them. Yeah, beat them to the punch, got lower, and, and that resulted in the touchdown because Tariq jumped, but he didn't have to jump that high. Got over that line. Okay. okay I'm trying to figure this out. We're down eight, and we're kicking one. This is a surprise to everybody here. Um, oh, good. Faked it. No, it wasn't a fake. He didn't get the snap. Didn't get the snap. Okay. Uh, um, a great scoring drive capped by a very questionable extra point. <laughs> uh, slash fire, fire, get the ball out of here. That's right. Uh, boy. Back to within eight. Mm. Okay. Uh, Man, I, we got to get that. We got to get that part shored up here. Yeah, for sure. I guess the thought there is um, get it to seven. Yeah, get it to seven and uh, and go from there. Both teams have kind of abandoned the extra point stuff. Southfield tried to kick one, and they've gone for two every time since. Mm -hmm. Okay, nonetheless though, we're back to one score here. Uh, one score. Yeah, we're in the fourth quarter. Pointer, yep. Nine so. thirty-eight left. Mm -hmm. Pressure squarely back on the defense. Text the control room so we can put that up. 26 18. I'm 
Got about 9.38 left. And once again, Davis's defense has got to come up big here. They've been they've been bending, but, but only broke once in the second half. Right. And, you know, we've had two big stops on them, and we got to have a third. We got to have a third. We don't want to get down two scores with under five left. Nice kickoff, taken at the seven. Oh, little bobble. Got to get to the corner. Right. Oh, nice closing speed right there. Holy moly. Is that Austin rolling with that? Now it's number that? 15. 15. Dylan Johnson. Wow, he shot out like a like Woo! a bullet or it was made a hair. tackle. Oh, it was hair. It was hair. Okay. I mean, I'm, I'm not hair. Oh. It was Lamar Hay, number 25. Okay, yeah. Wow, whoever that was, they came out <laughs> screaming on that play. Mm -hmm. All right, big wow. special teams play now. Sure uh, was. Got a mech starting at their own 12. Mm -hmm. Got to keep them down here in this end of the field. See if we can hem in this running game here. Keep them a small gains. Get them in. Get them in. Get them in a longer situation. Make them throw. This Southfield team. I'm looking through the roster. They got a lot of juniors. Mm -hmm. Definitely going to be a force next year. There's the inside give again. Okay. It's Fuqua. Out to the 16. Yeah, they had him hemmed up after two or three, but he just kept trucking. 17, give him a pickup of five, second and five. Strong running backs on both sides. Quarterback keeps. Everything's against the grain. Yeah. Get there. Oh, nice block on the outside. Never even really did much except put a shoulder into uh, Tyrese Watson, who was out there trying to cover that up. But a nice block, just got in his way. Yep, and that's all you need out there on the edge of times. First down at the 25. Southfield continues the drive and starts eating up some clock. Corner's playing really tight on the wide receivers here. I think probably to help support the run if they have mm -hmm. to. To throw to the outside, underthrown. That might get touched. Yeah. More importantly, stops the clock for us. Yep, it was tap. That was broken up at the line of scrimmage by Chase Chittick. Got his paw up there. Second and 10. Clock stops with 8.51 left here in the fourth quarter. Throwing on first down. Let's see what they do now. Inside give? Nope. There's that counter action. Oh, he missed the tackle in the backfield again, but do hold him to just a couple there. All right, so here's what we're looking for, a third and long, and we got it. Yep. All right, see if the defense can pin their ears back, but don't be surprised if they go with the run here. They've been very, very successful with that, so we'll see. McCarn in there at the tailback now. Trips to the wide side of the field for the Warriors. We got only two defenders. Mm -hmm. We still only have two defenders. Uh huh. Oh boy. Where is our safety plan? Oh, oh Darby! Oh man, he got that through there. Two of their it looks like two of two other guys receivers. hit each other. Yeah, the receivers ran the wrong route. One of them did yep. and collided because that was wide open. That was the first down wide was. open, and that was that was what they were looking for there. Trevor Brown got himself in the middle of all that. And Southfield has to punt. Davison gets the ball back. Fantastic. All right. Student section letting them know they appreciate that defense. I wish Austin Rowan would go to the ball and catch it here. Yeah, that would be a nice thing. He, he let one bounce in front of him earlier today. Oh, they're going to, they need another player. There we go. Nice stand by that defense once again. Absolutely. Oh, they throw that pass on first down, running the ball successfully. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa, high snap. Ooh. Ooh, got it away. The short kick, see if it turns over. Does not turn over, goes out of bounds at the 50. The ball's out of bounds, isn't it? He didn't call it out, Ruff. Well, then he said he stepped line. on the line. <sighs> Boy, that was just a that lot That sideline over there has been a problem. <laughs> Problem all night long, hasn't it? Yes, it has. It's a different official this time, but 
Then he stepped out of bounds when he grabbed the ball. Hmm. So Davison has the ball back. Eight minutes and one second remaining in the fourth quarter, down by eight. Cannon Hall, it's an end around to Roland, makes a man miss, looking for a block. Gets a few yards out to the 50. Southfield stayed home on that defense. Got a lineman with a shoe off out there, Brian Schaefer. seen him stop for a shoe. <laughs> Schaefer blew a tire out there, <laughs> making that crackback block. Second and six from the south field side of the football field. Reed. No, it's actually Hall on the keeper. Going to be just short. Boy, that was close to a late hit. Mm -hmm. Good fake on that. He, he really went up there with it, pulled it back, and uh, sucked in the defense. Got four. Needed five there, was it? Yeah, it's going to be third down in just a little bit more than a yard. So we're down eight here, 747 left. Cardinals driving just on the other side of midfield here, about the 44. Davison staying in the spread. Hall to throw, catch by Roland, makes a man miss and gets his first down. Nice play. Down to the 38. They keep playing off on rolling there. I'd go right back to that. That, that D-back was off about a good six, seven yards. I'd like to see that pass down just a little lower so he doesn't have to mm -hmm. waste any effort. Yeah, uh, that's the other part. Two inches higher, and that might be a pick six. Mm -hmm. So you got that, got that, uh, that dilemma there. Got to give Cannon Hall credit. He is really starting to feel his feel his own out there, I think, Randy. Yeah, the difference between him and the first and the second half, yeah, I just, think it's... You know, jitters. Yep, absolutely. Should be, big stage. Yep. Hall rolls to his right. Going to throw back against the grain. He's going deep down there. Oh, nice breakup. Mm -hmm. Intended for Fordham. Oh, they're going to... Oh, are you kidding me? They gave him a... Wow. They gave him a pass interference? And, and you could see. <laughs> that was terrible call. Yeah. I mean, it was it's for us, but that was really a bad call. Yeah, the defender's beside himself. I can't see this number there. It might be 12 uh, wow. for Southfield. Wow. Uh, if that is, that's Ian Brox. And he can't he played that, that perfectly. Flag. Yeah, he knocked it away. Knocked that pass away. Very clean play. Late flag. Wow. And the Cardinals benefit. Fifth, First 15 down? yards, yeah. Down to the 28, Cardinals on the march. 7-17 left here. Mm -hmm. Got to get it in the end zone. Okay, we're back to the two-back set. Oh, nice cutback. Reed's trying to get to the corner. Gets himself down to the 14. Oh, really late hit again. Man, they wiped out wow. the... Wow. Yeah, that... He was beyond the black. Hmm. Ref's got to work on getting control of that. Ref's yes. got to work on getting control of that. That was really late hit. So we are second and very short here. And the clock will run. Oh, now they gave him the first down. Whoa. Generous spot as well. And we yeah, the, we'll take it. Yeah, we're the beneficiaries of a few calls already on this drive. Ball spotted at the 13. It's just Reed and Hall in the background. 
And it's rolling on the end around. He's got the edge. He's got he gonna the edge. He's going to get the edge. corner. Oh. Gets close. Gets close. Doesn't go down. Doesn't give the defender satisfaction of putting him on the turf. I like that. Some strong legs. Makes it to the four. Going to be very close to a first down again. Yeah, big yard. Big yard is there. Eight or nine yard gain. Second and one. And I know it was late, but it was a good play by the uh, Southfield defender to get there and cut him off. Oh, absolutely. Zone. Yeah. No penalties right here. Yeah, got to like the just play. clean, just clean. Mm -hmm. Push it in. Got to like the play calling on this drive right here, keeping Southfield off balance. Nice variety. Two running backs. It is rolling. It is rolling for six. Davison now with a chance to tie with a two-point conversion, with 7:01 remaining in the fourth quarter. Give these kids and that coaching staff tons of credit. Yeah, we're starting to see what this team is made of, and they are not giving up. They are putting the fight to Southfield now, and I'd say momentum has definitely shifted at this point right now, Kim. Uh, Got to get a two-pointer. Come on, guys. All right. I'm guaranteeing they're not going to bring out the field goal kicker on this one. Come on, guys. Three yards. Push it in. Gives him a choice where he wants the ball. Where do we want it? Middle? It's like wants right it in right in the middle. Yep. I like that too. Keep him guessing. Right in the middle is good. Never been a short side of the field proponent. All right, so we're stacked up to the right. Hay is in the slot. They're going the other way on a slant. He's hauled, and he yeah. caught it anyway. Hey. He was held totally. And that is Austin Rowland. We got us a tie game. This Can you is believe it? Amazing. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Now we'll see who has a little spice up here as we go. 701 left. This game is tied. 26 apiece. Nice grab. Defender totally hanging onto his jersey. You could definitely see he's pulling his yeah, jersey. Yeah, he was back. just he had right on yeah. nothing. And how about this Hall kid <laughs> coming through here, throwing some bullets, slinging yeah. the rock around. And that passing game has really opened yeah, things up totally here. totally feeling confident now. Mm -hmm. Just got some of that, you know, the first half, just need to get some of that junk out of the system. Absolutely. Yep. Wow. Now I'm thinking back on a couple of big penalties that cost us points in the first half. <laughs> yeah. Keep it a little closer in the first half, and we got the lead here, right? Mm -hmm. All right. Back mm -hmm. on the defense. You know, now Southfield's going to open up their playbook again as well. Yeah, this, this is where it gets interesting yeah, now. They had gone close to the vest for a while, being up by three, almost three scores. All right, here we go. First thing starts with the kickoff coverage. Which last time was fantastic. Hay came down and made a great yeah, tackle. let's see that again. Ooh, Poocher. Good kick. Taking the 25. Got some room. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That's a real nice cutback. Oh, good tackle. I think that was the kicker that brought him down, a couple others. Number five for the Cardinals, Car Carrington Terry. Yep. So Southfield starts with a relatively short field at their own 41. They've got 6.55 of clock to work with. Both teams with two timeouts. This is crunch time. This is what we watch the games for, right? Who yeah, who would have thought at the end of that second quarter we'd be sitting right here at this point? Yeah, we were in dire straits going into halftime. Tells and, you uh, everything you need to know about these kids. Know it. Yep. Okay, let's see if they can complete it. All right, it. Need, another, need another stopper. Yeah. Got to play the whole game out, and this is fourth quarter time. They're staying strong to the left. That big tight end sitting over there right over the tackle. Yeah, they haven't thrown to him in a while. Don't be surprised to see him go there. Give up the middle. Oh, I missed some more tackles. Yeah. This is Fuqua. Man, he's moving the pile. First down. Picks up 13 on the first carry. Carrying one, two, three, four Cardinals yeah, on his back. You gotta get that guy in the thighs and below. And look yep. at those thighs. Yeah. Uh, and once again, we had a chance at the line of scrimmage or near the line of scrimmage yep. to bring him down and, and so just everything's up. It. Everything's up above though yeah. with the shoulders and you just can't bring him down up there. Absolutely not. Southfield looking for an answer. Fuqua again. Uh -oh. This time we get a slash cut, and we got a nice stop there. Three guys, four, five. And they still don't have him on the ground. And we finally got a whistle. Yeah, there it was. Uh, first guy through there was 24. 
And he... Ellis. Yeah, Ellis, Gabe Ellis. Ellis set it up, and then the rest of the Cardinals jumped on him. Lost three. Second and 13. All right. Nice. Southfield trying to go tempo. Historically, when we've stopped them on first, we've gotten out of these drives. Let's keep that going. 6-10 on the clock. Got to watch Baldwin here. Got to watch that tight end. Oh, wide open. That's going to go. Yeah, there, nobody's going to catch him now. Nobody's oh, going to catch man. him now. That was McCarn. Oh, right. right straight over the left tackle. Yeah. Never touched until he got in the end zone. Yeah. Great game. Great play up the middle. And well, stop this conversion. Yeah. Wow, 48 yards up the gut. And that is a dagger right now for this defense. Mm. Never even touched him until he got to the mm -hmm. at the end zone line. Yeah. And the Southfield crowd, which has been quiet much of the second half, erupts. And now the tides have turned once again. And Davidson finds itself in a six-point hole. Mm -hmm. And here we go with trouble getting the play called in for the extra point. Start the play clock. Let's go. I mean, most coaches have two to three, four plays ready to go for two-point conversions. Southfield they're seems gonna call, to be, They're going to call timeout. Yeah, this is not what you want to use They're going to call timeout because they're going to – he's outside of the coaching box by 10 yards. Yeah, <laughs> they're not calling that. Oh, the head, he's not the head coach. The head coach is the bald-headed guy, and they're waiting for the head coach to make the timeout call. Yeah. I'm not sure why that is. Okay, well, some potential good news there. Southfield blows a timeout on a two-point conversion where they've been yep. struggling all day. And we're looking at just under six minutes here, fourth quarter. A lot of time for Davison, but they need a stop right here. No doubt, no doubt. But the way our offense is moving, you got, you got to like our chances going down here to, 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 to try to tie this thing up. It's been definitely a game of two halves. Yep. Yeah, Davidson first half didn't look like they they were woke up. But something something right before halftime woke the beast. Yep. So here we go. Maybe it was something said in the, 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 yeah. in the locker room. Could have been a lot of things. And actually, the last play of the first half was a nice big run by Reed, and I think maybe that helped as well. Yeah, a little spark will do it. That's all, all right, the big back McCarn has gone in for Southfield, number 32. I know we keep saying this, but here we go with another big play. Sure is. Oh, they got uh, they're bulked up on the right side. Tight end sitting over the actually sitting over the guard tackle slot now. They've been running this one against the grain. Let's see what happens. Oh, oh wide receiver just jumped, but they did not call yeah, it. Yeah, they're going back against the grain, and he made it. Yeah. They bring that guy across the formation to take the uh, the slot defender with him, and it's been working. Yeah. <coughs> so Davison back down eight, five, 51 remains. A lot of ball game left. This thing keeps going back and forth, back and forth. Got some heavyweight punches like we might see on Saturday, right? Yeah, exactly. Well, maybe. I'm not sure. <laughs> not sure about all that. <laughs> yeah, I'm not spending the money. I'll tell you no. that. <laughs> I think I heard this morning that Mayweather put five million on himself, and if he wins, he picks up another million and a quarter on yeah. top of the what was it, 150 million, whatever he's making in. Anyway. Yeah, uh, some ridiculous amount of money. Guar guaranteed money. Yeah. Uh, I would have liked to have been a person in Massachusetts last night, though, too. <laughs> Is that where that money went? Yeah. yeah. I know I checked my ticket. It didn't one, look good. One ticket from a little party store. One ticket. One $700 ticket. $700 million. Uh, that's okay. We got the next best thing, a great game on a, on, Absolutely. on a Thursday night, not a Friday night, but we'll take it. Remember, it's Thursday again next week. Yes. We'll be home against the Oilers of Mount Pleasant. Yep. Game will be live on Channel 191. And DTV will be a full effect. We'll have the whole crew out there. All right, let's get some field position here on the kick. Squibber going to go out of bounds. Out of bounds. Nice job. Right. This 40-yard line isn't a bad place to start. And I'm sure Southfield's thinking the same way. 
instead of kicking it. <laughs> 35, right? We start on the 35. Oh, it's a 35? Yeah. Okay. Pretty sure. Gotcha. Yeah. Um, but Southfield's thinking the same thing. The 35 yeah. is not a bad place to start when you got uh, <laughs> when you got Roland back there waiting to return one. Yeah, you wonder how many opportunities he's going to get throughout the year. Mm-hmm. If there's any downfall to success, that's it. Mm -hmm. People adjust. Yep. People adjust. But then you have to readjust. Try and, try and take away weapons. Yep. You have to readjust and find other ways to get him in the offense. All right. Can Cannon Hall and this Davison offense step up one more time and try and get this thing retied? We open with two running backs. Hall to throw it, going deep down the sideline. Dropped. That was Slazak, I believe. He's had a couple go through the hands tonight. Yeah. One in the first half. That was the old sleeper play. Yeah. He just kind of stood over on the sideline there. Oh, is that what that yeah. was? I didn't notice that. Okay. Uh -huh. I mean, it can't be deceptive. He came into the huddle. Yeah. But yeah. he went out and just stood out there. Huh. Pulling out all the stops here at crunch time. That was a good pass, too. It was right on the money. I, this this Hall kid is impressive. Second and ten. All right, Davison's got to get the positive momentum going here. Hall, this is the inside screen. Oh, there was nothing there that time. Yeah, blew once, that up. Yep, yeah, blew it up, and once again, the pass is kind of kind of high, so you have to go up and get it, and it gives him no chance to make a move. Lost three. It's going to be third and 13. Oh, boy. 528, the clock is ticking. It's it's maybe too early to go for it on fourth down, but yeah. boy, I hate to give Southfield the ball back. I know. We and haven't been able to stop them the last uh, couple of drives here. I think a lot depends on what we get on this one. If we pick yep. up a good chunk here, I, I, I would see them going for it. But if we don't, you might have to punt it. All right, let's give them some time. Third and 13. Got to reach the 45. Got time. Got a man over the middle. Oh, he was wide open. I don't know if that ball was tipped. Might have been tipped at the line of scrimmage, but oh, he was. That was six. Yeah. That was Fordham. Wide open. Fordham across the middle. Got to punt it. Yeah. Yeah. They're gonna punt. Mm. Yeah. Fourth and 14, definitely. Oh. Mm. What could have been, right? Oh, he was been? so wide open. Yeah, that would have been that would have been a huge gainer. I don't know if that was tipped at the line of scrimmage. I didn't see notif any indication from the referees whether it was tipped or not, but yeah. it took a strange trajectory. It did. It did have so I've got to believe it was tipped. Oh, a we funny got oh, late guys coming onto the punt. Yeah, they weren't expecting us to punt. Still got time. Let's see if they can get set. Yeah, I don't want to waste the time out on that. Ooh, geez, not a good uh, kick there either. Oh. Eh. Maybe oh. 15, 16 Just yards. got past the line of scrimmage, yeah. or the down to gain. Uh, yeah, about 15-yard punt there. That's not what we wanted to see. Well, Southfield is in the driver's seat now, 447, left in the game, up eight. They're going to, you would think, run the ball and uh, try and run out that clock. Yeah, we have two timeouts remaining. Defense has got to make some stops right here. First down, yeah, big. No, no broken tackles here. Can't give up one first down. One first down is going to cost you a couple minutes. So what battering ram do they have in the backfield now? <laughs> Take your pick. It's Fuqua. Yeah. Give to him. And he's got room. Oh, oh no, man. nice tackle Woo! on the other. And he dropped the ball? No, the ground caused the fumble. Great tackle, Gabe Ellis. Gabe Ellis right again, yep. yep. And he went, get, went, went low and tripped him up. That's what you need to do. Second and ten. He basically got back to the line of scrimmage there. Mm -hmm. Ellis has made a lot of tackles tonight. Yeah. Expect to see that pretty much all season. Yeah, coming what? through and making plays. What are we doing, guys? We got to get back okay. by our side of the line of scrimmage. Yeah, hey, we're way past the ball. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> We have three Cardinals now almost in the uh, yeah. in the Southfield huddle. But they, they realize quickly that the, the ball spotted the other side. Clock so. running down to four minutes. Play action, watch play action. Mm -hmm. Although if I'm Southfield, I'm still just running it. Running the ball no matter what, yep. 
punt it away if you have to. Kick all the clock. Gonna be a timeout here by Southfield, I think. Timeout, yep. We saw the coaches running out and they were freaking out about something. Oh, I think it was a clock thing. Was it a clock issue? Last timeout taken by Southfield. Yeah. All right, good. They stopped the clock for us. Not sure what they were up in arms about there, but something wasn't right. Their coaching staff thought it was delay a game. Yeah, okay. Three thirty-nine left. Davison down eight. Southfield with the ball, second and ten. Praying for this uh, defense here to make a good stop. And get us one more shot at this. Mm -hmm. I'd love to see it in our hands to end the game to see, give us a chance. Second and ten, the ball sits on the Davison 48. We have 339 left in this contest. Give us the Fuqua. Nice Good play tackle again. there. Who's on the very bottom? Number 44? 44 or 14? Number 44 for the Cardinals being that stop, Trevor Brown. Mm -hmm. Okay, third in a long situation. Third in about five third or six. Third and five, yep. yep. Okay. I think it's going to be. You're going to see another run here after yeah. they let all the clock burn down. Uh, we get a stop here. I wouldn't be surprised if we pull out a timeout here. Yeah, we'll need to. Yep. Just about three minutes left. And Southfield not in a hurry to snap this, not no, in a hurry at all. They're going to use all of the play clock, just mm -hmm. like they should. Yep. It's good coaching there. Oh, got him hemmed up. Ooh, he's close, but he's a couple yards short. That was 32, McCarn. Mm -hmm. So it is fourth down. Davidson should burn their timeout right now. Yeah, I would take it right here. No need to wait. This, is, this is the game. If there's, a first, if there's a first down, the game's over. I would take the timeout here. And they do not. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I mean, a first down here, the game's over. You got it. All right. Mm. Fourth and about two and they now. They just got the play, so it's going to be at two minutes if they use all the play clock. Fourth and about two and a half, maybe. Maybe three. What's your call on that? Two and a half? Two, yeah. Uh, here he comes. Or he might be the quarterback. Cross action. Ooh, that's Trying deceptive move. Jump. That should have been yeah. the procedure. Quarterback made a move yeah, towards sure the line did. of scrimmage. Trying to draw us off. And that's gonna, a delay. Yeah, I think they might have done that on purpose. They now they're going to punt it. Yeah, yeah, they, they did that on purpose. But, boy, yeah. that, the quarterback, he, he he definitely came towards the line of scrimmage on that Darby did. Yeah, that's that's deception. Yeah, absolutely. But Cardinals hold, man. They All right. We're going to have two minutes to work with after this punt unless we block it. Didn't fall I think, for the trickery. I think I go all out to try and block it here, quite frankly. But. We'll yeah. see. Doesn't look like it. Looks like we're in a yeah, gonna play the return. We're in a safety safety position mm -hmm. here in case they in case they no, fake they it. Wouldn't, they wouldn't fake it. But. Yeah, not not after the penalty, especially. Good yeah. snap. Oh, another oh, straight in really the air. poor punt. Get out, right, of get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get Kick out left. of the way. Kick left. Kick left. Oh, went forward. Yeah. Wow, good bounce. Terrible bounce for Davison. All right, we're gonna have to go 80, 89 yards. 89 yards with a minute 53 and two timeouts. All right. Well, this is this is what you want. You want it in your hands with a chance to try and the mm. best we can do is tie. Uh, I remember a similar game uh, against Holt some mm. years back. Away, first game of the year. Garrett. Uh, we're, we're down. Yeah, Garrett with the pass across Garrett the middle. Garrett Stevens, yeah. He turned that into gold. So let's see if we can have a similar situation here. Remember that play in the last mm. series or series before? Mm -hmm. It was last series, yeah. Fordham was wide open. Yeah, we'll see if they go back to a similar. Got to protect here. Cannon here. Yeah. Line's been good on protection so far. Oh, fumbles half. the ball, picks it up. Lots of time. Lots Just of run time. it, got to run yeah. it. Got to get out of bounds, get out of bounds, get out of bounds, get out of bounds. Oh, he gets the corner and, and gets does get out, out of bounds. bounds. Out to the 42. How about the composure there? Oh, it's crazy. Yeah, unbelievable. First game ever starting on the oh. varsity level. And Roland's hurt. Roland's down. Looks like a cramp maybe. Hopefully that's what we got here. He will have to come out for a play. Hopefully not much more. 
Well, he's been hobbling around since that play in the corner of the end zone back in the third quarter. Or for, early that in this quarter. Yeah. Early in this quarter. Mm -hmm. That was Fordham, wasn't it? Or was that? It may have been. Oh, no, no, no. It was, yes. It yeah. was. Mm -hmm. Oh, he's laying down now. Let's see what they're doing here. Yeah, they're going to work on yeah, a, cramp. a cramp. Okay, all right. Hamstring or calf. Can't tell which one, mm -hmm. but that's a good sign. So, uh, Hall, he takes the snap, drops the snap, <laughs> picks it up. it together. Yep, do dodges a rusher and then picks up 30 yards on, on a scramble uh, play. Crazy. Yeah, he went from the 11 to the uh, 42. Oh, he's got a good speed, that. too. Yeah. Uh, and we were calling for him to go out. Yeah, back here. Yeah. I, I want him to out, out of bounds at the 18. Instead, he, turns he says, it. no, I can beat these guys down the field for a ways. <laughs> turns it up for another 20 yards and then gets out of bounds. Yep. Nice play. So 143 left, down eight here, guys. The Cardinals driving. They are out at the 42-yard uh, line. Yeah, one of your playmakers down on the field at the moment, though. Yeah, that's uh, not a good situation. First play of the first. Oh, he's actually doing a check on the knee is what he's doing. Okay. Hopefully he's all right here. Just a calf. Mm -hmm. Hamstring. Mm -hmm. Nice. He's stretching a cramp. I'm hoping that's that's the case. Well, this break in the action, I'm not sure who it's good for. Right. Defense or offense or yeah. neither. Yeah, we had uh, Southfield on their heels there for a moment, so maybe it's uh Well, he's reaching for his hamstring too, so who knows. Okay. Yeah, we'll see what happens here when he gets up. I want to see him pop up on his feet and walk. Yeah, that would be fantastic. Get him back in the next play. I'll see what he does here. It looks like that's what we're going to get. Let's see how he walks. A little gingerly, but he's on his own. <laughs> Hydrate, <laughs> young <drink>. man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the Southfield trainer comes over and gives him some water. Yeah. And if you got cramps, first game of the year. Mid-August. Huh. Looks like the Wayne State trainers down there, too. The green coat. Okay, that may have been who did it. Yep. Uh -huh. Okay, he's got a slight jog off. We'll see if he That's comes good. back in Moving. next play. Yep. First and 10, Davison sits on its own 42. Minute 43 left. They still have two, uh, two timeouts remaining. Got to get a touchdown and a two-pointer to send this to OT. Mm -hmm. Hall rolls to his right. Got nobody. Yep. He's going to have to get rid of it. Good throw. Oh, almost got a catch there. Avoids, the avoids the uh, grounding and almost got a catch. Mm -hmm. Is it Slazak again? It looks like it may have been. Second and 10. Offensive line holding up with decent protection. Let someone through that time, but uh, they've been pretty solid here mm -hmm. in the second half. Got to keep that up. As well oh, we got a bunch. Look at this. We got four guys yeah. in, a little, in a little bunch at the top. Included of that is Roland. It's going to be a screen. Nope, it's going down the middle. Oh, wide open. open! Wide open! Back. Oh, he's going to go! Unbelievable play. Oh, baby! 58 yards! Yeah! <laughs> Woo, that's a head 58 spread. yards! You oh, got, that had Southfield totally befuddled. you got 11 Southfield players looking around like, who is <laughs> the head of Slazak? Yes. All right. Part of it's done. Now the most important part, you got to get this two-point conversion. Got to finish it out here, tie this thing up. Holy cow, what a game. What a play Woo. call. Huh. Four wide right receivers in a box formation to the to the right. Everybody, including me, thinking, because Roland's in the back of that Screen diamond, they're going to throw a screen out there. Yeah, everybody bid on it, wide open down and the middle. who's had trouble kind of pulling them in tonight. <laughs> you couldn't miss that one, I'll yeah. tell you that. <laughs> He had time to slow down and eat lunch before they got to him on that one. All right, here we go. Got to get this one. All right, this is this is bigger than the last play right here. Hay and Roland. Oh, Roland, he's in. We're tied. We are tied. <laughs> All one twenty-eight remaining. Can you believe it? And the Cardinals come back and back and back and back. Wow. And now we're tied. Thirty-four, thirty-four. <laughs> We got a little man love going up here. This is not good. <laughs> uh, Coaching staff is a little happy. They are, but they're doing something right right now, calling these plays Absolutely. down there. 
Holy cow. Yeah, the fortitude of this team, what they're showing right now. This is, this is going to bode well for the next eight games coming up. Here we go. Let's see what Southfield does to answer. Huh. We gotta gotta pin them down just a little bit here. All right. Do not Let's see slap. if they throw boy a pick six to finish the game. Would that be kind of cool? Oh, that would be a, a fantastic play. Oh, we're setting up like we're gonna onside kick it. Oh, I don't know if you want to do that. Yeah, we are. No, no, we're not. Okay. No, no, no. That's just the way he tilts the ball. Okay. Looked like the way he was setting up yeah. side saddle to it that it was going to. There's no way we're going to do that. All right, 128 remains. We've got a tie ball game at 34. What a fantastic game. Nice deep kick. Good hang time on that. Picked up at the nine. Got some penetration. Good coverage. Oh, he makes a cut. Oh, nice, coverage. nice job. Yeah, that looks like. Uh, oh, don't do that. Don't, don't, don't. 35 of the Cardinals. Pascal. Pascal again. Yep. Keep, keep your head so straight, So A&T starts at their 26. No timeouts remaining for them. Two for David. And we'll see if we use them here. No timeouts, man. Back. A sack here burns a ton of time. Yep. Davis is desperately trying to get this game to overtime. Well, we know there's not really a field goal possibility yeah. from A&T either. So they're going to have to go the, the distance. Yeah. We'll see now if they're going to take a shot or if they'll be content to go in, too. Yeah, they're going to run it. Ooh, yeah. Nice tackle. Let's see if we call our timeouts here. We got two. I think both teams yeah. are probably trying to get it to OT. Appears to be that way. That's McCarn, the running back. Trevor yeah. Brown tackled him. It's about a minute left. See play action now. Play action. Yep, here we go. It's a pass. Get your hands up. Oh, great leap. Ooh. He Did he catch it. it? Didn't catch it. I think it hit the turf. I think. Oh, it, they're giving, they're it, to giving it to him. Huh. Wow, yeah. that one was missed. Yeah. I, I'm seeing coach over there, and Sean Sean wouldn't be saying it didn't happen if it didn't happen. That yeah. ball was on the turf. About a 16-yard gain there, so they're uh, going to have the ball at the 40. 53 seconds remain. Mm -hmm. That same referee. Surprised <laughs> I hate to not, say it. Yeah. Surprised we're not deeper. Okay, up the middle. That's going to burn some time. McCarn again. 42 seconds. I think Southfield's going to say if, if we can get it on a break, broken play or if not. Yeah. So we're down to 35. Clock is running. I could see that play action again here. Try to yep, go deep. Definitely. Yeah, you may want to back that safety off for a second. Roll him off. But Derby. There it is. There Going it down is. the slot. Overthrown. Overthrow. Yes. Boy, we got to get that safety deeper. That was one-on-one. Yeah. -on -one. We got to have Ford back there. I think he's looking, thinks he can just you know, jump up and get the ball, but yeah. it's time to play position right now. 24.1 seconds. It's third down, by the way, mm -hmm. at the 47 of Davison. Third down and six. Huh? Yeah, absolutely. We got to roll that safety back. Let's see what we do here with him. Mm. We got no help. Got to get some yeah. help on the inside. Deepen yeah. up, guys. Oh, gosh. Oh, it's just a run. This is the big bruiser. There you go. That's fine with us. And Let that's going to run the rest of the clock out unless they yeah. uh, unless they get up there quickly. That's no. Brunson. He's short. No Got hurry. 13 seconds left. No, they're going to try to call a play here. They're not going to get it yeah, off. Yeah, there's no way they get this off. Seven, six. We're going to, I think, five, oh, pay four. Pay attention, guys. Keep playing. Attention. Keep playing. We got. And there it is. Okay. They don't have any timeouts. They call a timeout? They, they don't, don't have any timeouts. What's was that a is that a 15 yarder? I don't think it matters. No. Who, no. Okay. They don't have any timeouts. The whistle came from this sideline, but they don't have any timeouts. He might have been caught blowing the quarter dead. Oh no, he's going out there. And this is an interesting situation. Calling a timeout with none left. They're just gonna decline it. That's gonna send the game to OT. Yeah. So yeah. Michigan High School Athletic Association uh, OTs, both teams get a chance. Start the 10 yard line, right? Yeah, 10 yard line, got four plays to punch it in. Yep. Um, you do that for a while, then you got to go for twos. Yep. Although, the way these teams are, they're going to have to go for twos anyway. I think that's in the game plan already. Yep. Oh, what a game. What We're a game. We're going to OT. Yeah, tied at 34. Like you said, this was, seemed like a lost cause going into halftime for the Cardinals, but they turned on a switch, flipped it, and here we go. What are they doing? What's this official doing? The game right. is over. I just think they have a timeout. They don't have any timeouts. Yeah, they've used all three. Well, how did the? How is the game? 
Why is there a play? They use two on defense and then two on a two-point Why is there a play going on here? This makes no sense. I'm very confused. We wouldn't have called a timeout. No, so there's two up there. This is their fourth timeout. Oh. Why is there a play happening? A lot of confusion here, but it looks like they're lining up for Another going to get a play. chance to throw a ball to the end zone. This makes no sense. Okay, we have three safeties deep here. They're going to get a shot at this. No argument from our side. Why? I don't know. This has no sense. The refs must have said they had a timeout left. That's all I can think of. So they're going to play an untimed down. Oh, 0 0.7. How can Point they get How can they get any time on the clock? Right. This guy was blowing his whistle, and he stopped the game. Now they get a chance. Uh, okay. This reminds me of Central Michigan and Oklahoma yeah. State last year. Yeah. Let's should never even be play. This shouldn't even be happening. Yeah, this play should not be happening. Everybody is back. And now he's going to throw. Yeah, he's going to throw a bomb to the end zone. Yeah, and we got three three safeties. Get some pressure. Yeah, here it comes. Got some pressure. Oh, they're just going to get. Yeah, yeah, yeah that'll take care of that. Okay, well, we we dodged that bullet, um, and now we are going to overtime. What the heck is going on with this officiating crew? Yeah, that was a. Uh, wow. That was an awkward situation, but it looks like they did stop the clock. It's point seven. Well, how? And, and they let him huddle for a timeout, so I'm guessing. I'm didn't guessing, have any timeouts. I'm guessing the ref gave him a fourth one. It's all for not. Hey, liking it. Mm -hmm. So let's see. They'll have another coin toss to see who gets. Uh, uh, okay, looks like Davidson. No, they're calling Davidson back off of the field. All right, they're going to take a little break here, I think. Oh, well, they don't know what they're doing, so yeah. they're talking about. Yeah, the rules. They're getting it together, yeah. But there should be a coin toss here to see who gets uh, right. the, you know, the winner gets ball or chance. Or to, chance yeah. And you want to play defense first, of course. Yeah, that way you know what you have know to what do. Know what you got to do. <laughs> <laughs> Both crowds still here. It's getting late. We're in downtown Detroit, and we have ourselves an overtime situation here. If you thought you were getting back to Davidson before midnight, you're probably already rethinking that. I'm going to Grand Rapids today. <laughs> you got to drive to Grand Rapids? I got a two hour and 45 minute drive oh, from here. 96, here you come. Oh, yes. <laughs> Spent some time on that expressway. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go visit my new grandson. Oh, nice. Congratulations. Thank you. <laughs> come on, guys. Let's get this going. Emily? Emily's kid? No, Megan, my oldest. Okay. Yep. Cool. Oh. First one? First, grand First one. First grandkid. Nice work. Well, you would think Davison has all the momentum, but who knows? This game has gone back and forth. Yeah, momentum happens with whoever has the ball, it seems. Exactly. <laughs> I mean, are we going to play, or are we just going to stand out there and talk? Yeah, I think uh, I think this is like a second half time here. We're taking a lot of time to get this figured out. Let's get a coin toss. Let's get back to where we're at. All right, what a game so far. What a game so far. We've seen a lot of ups and downs. Davison battles back from two scores down, ties up the game. Southfield comes back, takes the lead by eight. Davison answers once again with a fantastic play up their sleeve. Slazak going 40, 40 plus yards for a wide open touchdown. Two point conversion, good. We're all knotted up at 34, and this game just keeps giving. About to go to overtime. Waiting on the coin flip, flip here. Don't know why we're waiting so long, but here we are. Okay. Now they're ready for captains. Oh. We have to order breakfast then, Randy. I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know looks like the french fries are yeah. gone over there, man. Yeah, it looks like they packed those things up. They're probably peeling the hash browns now mm -hmm. for the morning, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Want to be some of those fries. <laughs> we have to hit Lafayette on the way home. There you, oh, yeah, there you go. <laughs> oh. So crazy things have happened in overtime in Detroit. You remember the Thanksgiving Day uh, I do. Jerome Bettis coin toss? Yeah. <laughs> That's why all three officials stand with their ears now. Exactly. <laughs> We won the toss. And we should be playing defense. Going to play defense, and then they get to pick which end they want to go toward. 
Wind not a factor, really. Slight breeze no. um, heading, yeah, heading toward the yeah, they're uh, gonna We're going to keep playing the same way we were playing. Now, when Davison gets their chance with the ball, they'll also go at that same end zone. Mm -hmm. Nice field, nice facilities here. Everything's held up well. Especially being the second game of the day, this really helps to have field turf. Yes. This official is over here still explaining to the coach how, what happened at the end of that game. I, I would like to know. Yeah, they need to explain to our coach, I think. You know, the South Fields seem to be the beneficiary of whatever happened there. Yeah, they got a chance for another down, and they should never have gotten it. I think they let him have the down because he was blowing his whistle over here. He I stopped play, so you can't just start it inadvertently. Right. Yeah, and you can't just pretend that the clock was already dead. I'll ask my uh, officiating buddy at work. Mm -hmm. I'll see him on Monday. Well, this is, remember, this is the second game tonight for these guys, too. This fishing crew is the same one that was at the oh, first game. Oh, they did the first game? Yeah, they've been, they've been out here for s over six hours. Gotcha. Uh, I can see why they'd be trying to end it in a regulation. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's tough. Tough yeah. to do. Yeah. I know I know. We, we, we harp on these refs, but, man, that's a tough job oh, out there. Oh, absolutely. Especially tough this job. game, it's moving. There's so much speed going yeah. on out there. Yep. All right, here we go. Southfield gets the ball first at their 10. Gotta stop this run. Looks like the running back is McCarn. And he gets the first carry. And he's got room. Boy, get him down. He's in on the first play. Wow. Didn't take him long. Wow. Same play that they've had so so, so much success on. All right. So All right. We'll see, see if they try and kick an extra point again or if they're going two. I'm sure they're going they two. Gotta be lining up for two. Yeah, let's see Coach Dunning with two mm -hmm. fingers up. And we got a timeout as well. Because they don't. Because they can never get their play in <laughs> for the two. Yeah. Each team is awarded another timeout during the yeah. overtime. I don't know if I've ever seen a team have this much confusion over two point plays all game long. Yeah, you would think, like you said, every coach has three or four just in the back pocket ready to go for yeah. this. You, know, you practice them, you know them, you do them. Yep. Yeah. yeah. All right, we'll see. The big play here, though, for the defense here. We can, we can shut them down on this, and we can get in ourselves. We have a chance to win. Mm hmm. What a game. Well, there's our band. Haven't heard them all night except for their little performance at yeah. halftime. There they are. If I'm them, I run the same play. Why not? <laughs> you only got to get three yards. Yeah. And he did it for 10. This easy. guy's a butt battering ram, man. Got him set up on the other side, though. See if we get motion across the formation. Yep, here it comes. Yep. Same play. Other yep. side. Other way. Yep. Got him oh, stopped this time. Ooh. Oh, did he get in? This is close. He's down. No, no he got him short. Short. Nice play by the defense. They really clapped. Woo, here we go. Okay, we a got chance a chance to win this game. We got a shot right yeah. here. We're here we in, go. We're in position. All right. Got to get in the gotta end zone first. Got to get in the zone first. That's, That's right. right. All right. We got four plays to stuff it in, and then we can go for the win. Wow, mm. ah, well, a great time for that defense to tighten down. Mm. Mm. They have had no answer for our offense either. Let's see. Yeah, he looked like he was going to get in there with the initial surge. And then We've been pretty unpredictable in the second half on the play calling. Yeah, I mixing like it. it up great. I like it. Mixing it up great. I wouldn't be shocked to see him come out in that square and run something off mm. that again, you know, <laughs> just to just to get in their head a little bit. Let's see how we do it. <laughs> All right, we're going with uh, three backs. We're going to the full house here. Okay, last time we did that. Ellis is the man in the middle. Southfield You've got uh, Hay on the right and Reed on the left. Oh, oh we got no, movement. We Didn't call oh, it. Thank goodness. This is Reed. Cut up. All right. Picks up four down to the six. Yep. Good gain on first down. Good gain on first down and missed the penalty. We jumped early. Wow, they marked him all the way back at the seven. Ugh. Ugh. I'm watching these two lines judges. Neither of them ever run to the ball. Yeah, that's a, that's a, a little mosey mm. up. Anyway. Second and goal here from the seven. 
Taking our time. Getting out of that three-man look. We're going back to our regular spread. All right, Roland's back in. He we may have to burn a timeout here. He went out earlier with a, a Just burn a timeout. There we go. Get it settled. Yep. All right, Davison has three, so now we have two. Two must have carried over then, huh? Yeah, we had two, and you get the one additional when you. Mm -hmm. All right, we're looking at a second and seven when we come back from the seven. Wow. Could the <laughs> ultimate comeback happen? Yeah, if we could pull this thing off, I tell you. <laughs> Talk about some momentum. Yeah, exactly. Even even if it doesn't happen, they they, they know they can play. So. Yep. Kind of a mess there in the first half. Mm -hmm. Once again, we'll be with you next Thursday night at home versus Mount Pleasant. Hope to see you at the game, but if not, check us out on DTV Channel 191. And Mount Pleasant's no slouch either. They, they turn out some good teams, so we're in for another challenge early on. And then Carmen comes calling. <laughs> <laughs> kind of loaded up in the front. Yeah. And at the end. Yes. Yes. Appear for homecoming this year. That'll be fun. Yeah, it will be fun. That game is starting to pick up momentum every time they face off now. Yeah, there's not much love lost there yeah. for sure. We had back to back in the, with the playoffs and that last year. So here we go. They'll appear in powers to end the season. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. We have uh, Hay to the left, Reed to the right. Hall's your quarterback. Gives it to Reed. He's, He's got, got it in. He's in. He's in. Chance to win coming up right now for the Cardinals. Oh, great Are we going to kick it? I don't. Are we going to kick it? I don't know. Let's see. It looks no like flags. We'll see We're tied we again. We got people cramping all over the place. There's now our guy from Southfield cramping up there. Huh? They are going to kick Davison it. Davison is going to try and kick it They're to win try it. To kick it. Here we go. This is it. <laughs> Here we go. It comes down to one play. One play in this game. Win or lose. Come on. Clean exchange. Uh -huh. Good kick. All right. Holy crap. Can I say crap on the air? You can say that today. <laughs> yes, you can. This game will make you say some things, okay? <laughs> Come on. Good snap. Come on, Cannon. Snap is good. Oh, oh no timeout. Ice in the kicker. Is that what we got here? They didn't have any well, timeouts. They, they, they don't have any timeouts. Left. They don't have timeouts left. Illegal substitution. Oh, okay. We don't want that anyway. All right, legal substitution, and we're going to get closer. Did we go for two now that we're no, closer? No, 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 okay, Just kick so. it. Yep. If you trust enough to kick, you want to kick it from here anyway. It yeah. makes the angle a little better as far as the get it through there. Exchange was good on that one. Let's see if we can do that again. One more time. Come on, guys. Yep. You hear him down there? I need a block. Yeah. Come on. It's up. No, no missed good. it to the left. No good, and we remain tied. This kicking game is just uh, excruciating. It is tough to watch right now. Okay, once again, another flip-flop. We're going into double overtime here. So Southfield will get, get, the, uh, get the ball again at the 10. I think now we take the ball. Oh, we take the ball. We get it first this time? Okay. So we're going to stay on offense and try <gasps> to stay it in the end zone again. Oh, they're going to flip. They're going to flip again. Okay. Unbelievable what we're going through today. I mean, those aren't even close, though, so we, we got to yeah. just go for two. Yeah, I got to get them in there. Yeah. <laughs> Coach is scratching their head, too. Here. They thought we had this one all the way in the bag. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> wow. Yep. No, no school tomorrow. That's a good thing. <laughs> <laughs> we are off on Friday because uh, this game is keeping us up late. So, as we wait to see who's going to be in possession here. Nobody's left. Crowd's still hanging in there. Waiting to see who's victorious here. Well, if you stuck around for this one, you've seen a good one. 40 to 40 in the second over overtime. Hmm. And it's almost like three different bowl games we've played. Just the way things have changed and changed and changed again. Mm. 
All right, another coin toss. Well, they give them a lot of time in between them. Not sure why Southfield has their team on the field. They don't know if they're playing offense or defense. Yeah. They seem to be content to play defense right now. <laughs> That's who's out on the field. Yeah, I thought it. I didn't think there was a coin toss. I thought it was just. Yeah, an alternating. Uh, yeah. Also, it's just to decide which side of the field you want to go to. Yeah. Okay. All right, so Davidson will have the ball, and we will see what happens. <laughs> I know we're not going to see an extra point attempt with the kick. Now you have to go for two at this point. Two inconsistent. Mm. <sighs> <laughs> thought it was over. Makes you wonder, huh? Thought it was over. Yeah. Hopefully that uh, that offense and defense are over there regrouping and getting themselves back in this game because we got some game to play. Got to get it in the end zone again. First things first. Huh? Same set. Hate to the right. Slays that. Reed to the left. That's what we got. Yep. Reed. He's got to turn the corner. A good block on the edge. He's going to turn the corner. He's down to the two. Yep. Good job. Boy, both teams are playing so hard. They are. Poor number eight. He is just. He is cramping on every play. Still sticking his nose in there, trying yeah. to make a tackle. <laughs> Crazy. Yeah, what we put ourselves through, huh? <laughs> mm -hmm. So that going to go on the two. <laughs> Great push by the offensive line that time. Yeah, they got finally him, got him got out of there. Back. Yep. Poor kid. Yeah. He He's wants to be out there, but you can't function if you can't walk. Right. Mm -hmm. All right, second and two. Yes. We just flip-flop the backs. Reed now on the right. He gets the ball. Right up and the he's gut. And he's in the end zone. Yep, there it is. So there's the first part. Easy. Yeah. Easy. Boy. Right, yeah, line back up and let's play. Let's forward. line up and get a two. Yep. Okay, so 46-40. Davison now in the lead. And this uh, first lead of the ball game, correct? No, we scored first, didn't we? Right. Yep. So second lead of the ball game. We scored to open up scoring in the first quarter. And now we take our, our lead, and we are lining up for two, as should be the case. We changed the formation. Oh, no, no, same thing. Reed is still to the right. Hay to the left. Cannon Hall between them, the quarterback. It's Reed again. He's in. There we go. Okay. That's we should have done last time. Yes. So we, All we, right, so we're up eight. And now we go back to defense. Yeah, we can't lose in this situation. We can, they can just try to tie First, you go to, yeah. Mm -hmm. And I think from here on out, everybody has to go for two. two. If they score here and get two, we'd have to go. Everybody just goes two the rest of the way. Wow. All right, the defense has to come up big once again. It seems drive after drive, we keep saying the same thing, but here it is. Okay, it's McCarn at the running back for them. And he's been the workhorse here in the fourth quarter. Single back set. Oh, we got two backs, sorry. McCarn up the middle. Following his blockers. Boy, what a nice run. Uh, he's down to the two. Carbon copy play of the one we just saw from Davis. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Did you see him? He had read a hold of his blockers. Yeah, he was riding back. the blockers, blockers back. Because they couldn't, couldn't get to his legs. Yep. And rolled him as far as he could, and then cut off for another couple yards at the end. Yeah, I think need a turnover. Yeah, yeah, we do <laughs> need a turnover. Something's going to happen. Here he goes again, McCarn. He's, He's in. in. He's in. Okay. All We're right, down to the two-point play again. Right, we stopped him on this last time. Let's see if we can come up big here. All right. This is the play that decides it. Do we keep going, or do we wrap this thing up? We had yeah. the same situation in the first OT. Yeah, I would take a timeout here. Looks like we're gonna. Looks yeah. like we're gonna. Yep. And I think that's might as well. You got yeah. might as well not take it in the bag. Yeah. 
I think that's what Blaze and the rest of the crew is going to tell him right now. Is you, this is your play, you know? You uh, suck it up here. I don't see stop. anything fancy from Southfield either. No, they're they're not going to throw the ball. You know what they're doing. They're running that ball on you know that it. slant. Yep. They're going to say stop us. Now, the only thing you can see here is the quarterback giveth and then taketh away. You yes. Know? Yep. Once again, incredible day. <laughs> It's 10.30. 10.30. Three and a half hours we've been on at this. Yeah. yeah. We thought the last game went long. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Southfield fans, you can hear them stepping mm -hmm. up here, trying to trying to urge their team on. They want to see some more football today. We, on the other hand, do not. <laughs> we want the game to end right mm -hmm. now. This would be a good All right, here we go. And you see that man come across the formation, I think, here. Oh, maybe not. Not the way they're set up here. Oh, oh what? Flag. What happened the, there? What's the flag? They're in motion. They had motion? Their guy on the outside left. I think we got motion on the outside yep. receiver. It's going to come back to the eight. Okay. This Now we got a pass play. Okay, here we go. Oh, he's pointing. What's he pointing at? Move him back. Oh, no, going to be on Davis? What's he? We're offside? How can we be offside lining up on an extra point? I, I, don't, I don't get it. Now they only got to go a yard and a half. Uh, all right, the defense's job just got monumentally tougher. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I think any one of those backs could just fall forward for a mm -hmm. yard and a half. If they score here, I think we do go back to a coin toss. Yeah. All right. Both backers are going to shoot the gaps here. See them creeping in already. Mm -hmm. yep, only now one. we got another flag. Uh, Hopefully this is against them. Yeah, we can move them back to the six here. Oh, we got movement. We got movement. Right. Now we're going back five. This helps us immensely. Back to the six and a half. There we go. All right. Catching breaks, catching breaks, catching breaks. Got to turn it into something here. Turn it into something. Wow. Huh. Are you kidding me? This, <laughs> this game just keeps taking more twists. All right, turns. now anything's possible here mm -hmm. at the six and a half. They got to get it across the uh, end of the end zone to get that two-pointer. 48-46 Davison right now. We're at the end of the second overtime of what's been a really interesting evening. Still McCarn. Now you got two receivers to the wide side of the field. Darby to throw. No pressure. Now he's got pressure. No place to go. Scrambles. He's got a man wide open. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Broken play. Yeah. Made it work. Yep. Defensive back came off thinking the quarterback was scrambling the run. Oh. And dumps it right off. Nice play. Here we go, overtime number three on the way, people. Oh my gosh. We are tied at 48 apiece, and this game just keeps <laughs> on going. Uh, I can't remember a triple overtime. I might, there might have been um, one, but I don't remember. I'm thinking we had a, we have one. We had one against Carmen on homecoming, and I think that was a double overtime. Yeah, I don't know that we've been to three. Um, I'll have to check. I have to check the record books there. <laughs> but this one is uh, getting later and later. Mm. Wow. Broken play. Quarterback had his head up. Defenders, of course, are trying to commit. Do I come up and get the quarterback and try because he has a chance to run it in? Or Yep. Had him, had him caught in the in-between land and dumped it over their heads and wide open receiver. Makes the play. Mm. Both teams regrouping here. What do you have to do? Wait, do they have to wait like three minutes between it or something? Must be. Must, must be. be a mandatory kind of wait rule. period. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Missed extra points. Yeah. Both teams. Yep. 
Not many turnovers in the game. He had an interception earlier. One interception. That yeah, that's it. it. One turnover in a three-overtime game. So both teams have been been solid there. Lots of penalties. Lots of penalties. Yeah, lots of. A lot uh, of big penalties. Yeah, a lot of big ones. On sportsman likes some uh, interference calls. We had some. Yeah, we had a questionable interference call that helped us out. Yep. Um, Maybe a couple of non-calls that yeah. helped them. Yeah. That caused other calls to happen. Yes. Yeah. Well, here we are about to start our third overtime. First game of the year. This could be a this could be a sign of yeah, a if this is a, Yeah, <laughs> this is what the rest of the year is going to be like. Yeah, if Mount Pleasant goes this long, we're going to have to start thinking what's going on here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so who's got it, Southfield? Uh, I didn't see the rolling. It looks like that. Yeah, looks yeah like we're on defense. Field. Okay. So we're back on D, which is where we want to be in this situation. Boy, it'd be nice to get a stop, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. it? Would change everything at this point. Mm. Game like this, you kind of hate to see it decided, at, you yeah, know, exactly. at, like this. But you know, this is the way the rules are structured. Real talent on both teams. Lots of speed, some good size, mm -hmm. lots of playmakers. These teams are gonna, these teams are gonna make it make it difficult for teams coming down the road. All right, they stay with McCarn. Oh, we got a. Geez, we don't have enough guys on the field. Uh, after that long of a break, you got to. How be do we ready. not have our defenders on the field? Right, we just burned our timeout. Time yep. Got one left. One. Yeah, we only had 10. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta be ready in that situation. You just had a gigantic break. Mm. You usually had the offense stand in one place, the defense stand in another place, yep. waiting to see who wins the toss. And you've just been standing around for five minutes. Exactly. Yep. Mm. Right. Looks like we've got a full squad out there again now for defense. Is there an answer? Does either team have an answer on defense? Something's got to give. Let's hope it's not us. Oh, high snap. Oh. Man, still picks up four. Yeah. Just when you think there could be the break we need. Yeah, <laughs> over the head. Yeah. Great job by the quarterback there to go up and get that. Darby just went up there, one-handed that high snap, turned it into a game. Makes me think he might be a basketball player, too. Yeah, he looked like a rebounder on that, right? Ball's on the six, second down. Well, we're guaranteed this game's probably going to get to the 50s. <laughs> yeah, one way or the other, it almost has to. Yeah, I don't see any field goals in anybody's future. Nope. McCarn. Nice oh, play. nice slashing. Oh, oh, he still has fake. quarterback, still has it. Oh, Darby. missed tackle. Great fake by Darby. Wow. Missed tackle out there. We had him lined up and just didn't make the tackle. I think everybody on that defense thought that play was over. Yeah, but we still had it. Yeah. We still had it stopped dead. Yep. So touchdown there for uh, Southfield. They move into the lead by six. 54-48 mm. and it's down to stopping the two point conversion at this point. <laughs> See Southfield gonna call their timeout right now? <laughs> they might. They have on every other two point conversion. <laughs> If they don't have a play by now, yeah, I mean, I'm about to just yell I mean, a play what do, you, down. What, do you, what do you need? They've been running the one play pretty successfully. Yeah. Give it to the big back, one of them. And still McCarn. Mm -hmm. This is going to be the motion play. Mm -hmm. Slot receiver is going to come across. Yep. There he goes. And there's the handoff, just like you said. Short, 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 short. Oh, they pushed oh, him in. 
Oh, no, he's still I fighting. still think they got him out. I think he stopped. Did not make it. Hey, called him a big stop yeah. by the defense. Holy crap. Coming up big of his hard. <laughs> Looked like he was going to get pushed in, and more guys just joined in, and just those days in the weight room yeah. just paid That's off. Right, right there. Right there, absolutely, man. Keeping the feet moving, driving them back. Holy oh. moly. Both teams tried to push him either way, and, man, <laughs> We come up big on that. The Cardinal defense stands strong. Oh. And here we go. We've been in this spot before. We got to get in and punch it in twice now. So it remains 54-48. And third overtime, Davison's ball. And they got four <laughs> downs to punch it in, man. This game. <laughs> this game. If we get in this here. This is epic. Yeah, this is epic. They it's really epic if you win. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> More epic for the team who comes out now. Yeah. All right, here we go. Hay to the left. Rolling to the right. Have or, no, I'm, I'm sorry. No. Reed to the right. This is Reed. Yeah. Making people miss. Gets mm -hmm. down to just short of the five. That box was full of red jerseys. Sure was. Still got five out of it. Mark him at the six. Give him four. It's tough sledding now. Oh, we still got Roland still cramping up over there. Fighting it, man. They're fighting that fatigue off any way they can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this, like you said, this is that extra rep in the weight room. This right is that here. extra sprint at the end of practice. Exactly. This, is, this is where that stuff comes into play right Both now. Both teams know the other is just going to run the ball. They are just jamming up the box. This is Roland. Cuts back. Oh, Can't quite tackle. get away. Okay. Down to the two. All these men are at the three. Three. Okay, third down Whoa. situation here. Yep, I thought he was going to slip that one. He's been slipping that all day. He had help that time. No, there was two guys on him mm -hmm. instead of just the one. All right, third down and three. All right, who wants it? Got to get in here. Got to get in here. This is the first time we've seen a third down on a, in the yes. overtime, I think. Yep. Yeah, everybody's been scoring up first and second. Seems to be a little confusion. All right. We do still have a no, we've used our timeouts, right. so we're all done. Okay. Boy, look at them come. Oh, they're they're packing that middle. Yep, maybe jumps. Maybe they jump. Oh, we gotta jump. Oh. There's a huge penalty. Yep. Third and eight now. Third and eight. Still four down territory, though. We're okay. <laughs> Listen, both teams going yeah. back and forth. <laughs> <laughs> They're giving it up, man. Everybody's putting everything they got out now. Got no timeouts. Come on, guys. Get a play in. Yeah. You got two plays to do this. Just don't have to get away from what you do. Yep. Just got to do it better. They do have to move here, though. I have here. They're taking a long no, wait, time. Watching the back judge. No hand yeah, yet. No hand. Okay. All right. Reed is to Hall's right. Hay to the left. Looks like there's still a little confusion. Mm -hmm. It's a pass play. Hall rolls to his right. Throws it. Got it. Go ahead. All right. There it is. That's Goyet. Goyet with a big catch. And we are tied once again. No need to celebrate. Let's get the two yeah. and get out of here. We got a chance to win it right now. There's okay. no way. There's no way they're going to kick it, are they? They cannot oh, line up for is, an extra point here. He's going to kick it. They're going to kick it again? He keeps looking to the sideline. He's looking for his, his placeholder. No. no. They're going to go for it? No, they're going for it, yeah. Okay, they are going to go for going two. To the, going to the spread. Fordham's back in, so they're going to go to the spread. And I would be shocked if Reed does not get this hand off. Yeah, give him the ball. Let him go. Yep. Come on, guys. No delay here. Let's go. Yep. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Get up to the line. Let's make this he hasn't play even got the He hasn't even done the play. Ugh. All right, single back. Leads me to believe they might We be. are in total spread here. Yeah, they don't know the play. It leads me to believe they're calling something different here. Now Southfield gets a timeout. They're okay. last. All right, that's good. All right, that's yep. good. That gives us some time to get a yeah, play call, too. We didn't look prepared, so that, that helps us. Yep. <sighs> Comes down to the last play again. Of course, a lot of plays are the last play in overtime, aren't they? Could be the last with a potential last play. Holy camoly. Oh, DTB crew out there still working hard. <laughs> Getting us some highlights. I 
told him we'd be back by midnight. That may have passed. Yep. <laughs> Game. They're going to look back at just the, how Incredible. many things happened. You can just Are we in the third overtime? We're in yeah, the third overtime. Third overtime. Third We're overtime. starting to lose count. Yep. <laughs> Second opportunity to win it. All right, line them up. Let's do it again. Hopefully for the last time. Davison going for the win. Two point conversion. Now we've gone point. back to two backs. Okay. We've changed the formation again after the timeout. Okay, we still look like we're confused. We just came out and we're missing a guy. There we go. Late substitution. He didn't come to the huddle. He doesn't know. He didn't come to the huddle. Is this going to be a problem? No. Okay. Bringing him in. Cannon straighten him out. Didn't know what the play is. Yeah. Still good on time. There we go. Don't need to rush. And there's Reed. And there's the win. No. 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 Yes! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Three. Oh times. my gosh! There we are. The boys pull it out. Oh, the way this game was ending at the end of the second half to this, this is going to start a great season. Yeah, this definitely changes everything about what we started. The first half, not indicative of how we finish. Big momentum builder. Davidson Cardinals win three overtimes, 56-54. We're final, and that team has now something to build on. Absolutely. That character is strong with that team, and we will see them throughout the season Woo! now. Boom. That is what I'm talking about. We will see you next Thursday night at home versus the Oilers from Mount Pleasant. This is DTV signing off.